Are we going? Yeah. We're oh, going. I don't know. Are we? Is yeah. this the Theo show? We are oh, wrong. welcome to this past weekend, guys. We got Will Sasso hey, here. Hey, what's up? One of the um, probably top two or three hundred men in in America, maybe. Yeah, yeah. I made the uh, well. This past year, I was in the uh, just edged out of the top two hundred, but I was in the top three hundred men yeah. in America. Yeah. And who do people a lot of times who beats you out for that? Like, is there a guy you're always neck and neck with? Yeah, there's a guy named uh, well, there's a guy named Dale Fuzz who uh-huh. lives in Kentucky. Oh yeah. Who uh, he's a school bus driver and he's a man. And uh, he, he, him and I go back and forth a lot. We got a, a lot of the same type of man I things. I see that D-Fuzz, dude. And, uh, bus Kevin, 161. Uh, Sometimes the bus drivers will get that horn, the horn from a uh, a rig, you know, put in yeah, the bus. put in the bus. Or if you're, if you're, in Dale's case, he has one of those, just this sort of thing. Mm-hmm. So he can work this arm because he's Ooh. also the high school uh, football coach. Oh, yeah, of course So, yeah, is. but Dale's got it like that. And we both like smoked meats and shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. So we kind of go back and forth. And me, him, Kevin James. Oh, wow. Yeah, I yeah. could see that. Hovering around that 200 mark. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm always fighting for the 200 in, <laughs> in men's magazine. Man magazine. Top 200 men. <laughs> Do you? How? Because you're kind of a bigger guy if I look at you. I don't you. know. I don't know. I, if I'm, I'm reading around, your name, it uh, seems like, oh, we could be any size. I'm about 165 pounds really? right now. No, yeah. you're not. I'm about 165, 170 pounds. Are you saving up weight for something? Yeah, yeah. I'm ge- I'm getting ready for the for I'm playing the da- I'm in the Dale Fuzz story. Oh, are you really? Yeah, we're gonna oh, shoot wow. the Dale Fuzz story. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It's independent, so we'll see who else is we'll in see it. See what happens. Uh, well, Dale Fuzz has a cameo. Yeah, yeah. So he's hope. playing. He's playing <laughs> a bus driver, obviously. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So that'll be fun. And it's uh, me, him, Tony Collette. And, oh yeah, uh, Harlan yeah. Williams. Harlan Williams. Okay, yeah, you read the Hollywood Reporter. <laughs> Gary Buscemi. <laughs> Gary Buscemi, who finally gets a role after all these years, yeah. you know, being in the shadow of his, <laughs> know, of his little dude. brother Steve. Yeah. Um, so it's gonna be a good. It's gonna be a good flick. Yeah. What's wrong with Chris D'Elia? Do you think? Because that's, what's wrong with Chris yeah. D'Elia? Fuck, I don't know if we Let's, have enough time. <laughs> Uh, if you had to pick six things, dude, because I don't want to be mean. Six to him. things. Yeah. <laughs> Holy fuck! Let me just say him. right now, I'm keeping the sand hat on, but it's hot as fuck in here. It's not that hot now. What happened? You said you were burning a candle, dude. I'm in a well, day. Oh, what happened? What oh, the we fuck had a guy happened in here who had Tourette syndrome, no, and not, not, that has nothing to do with how well, hot. You left it is a lot of here. heat. Also, you don't know how to wear clothes. You would maybe be cooler. Yeah, I do not know how to wear clothes. If I learned a little, if I learned a thing or two about wearing clothes, dude, black is a hot hot that's color. all i wear that's all i fucking wear well right there Black. dude what is wrong with delia uh no he's good wait hold on let's think of yeah something, i guess though. he's all right i guess but let's he's think right. of well what's wrong with brand uh br- um brian callen yeah <laughs> <laughs> brian's strong for a little guy for like an older guy yeah he is he's a very strong 63 you know? year old man <laughs> <laughs> Damn. um dude he has to be worrying about existence you know yeah yeah, he must be worrying about his mortality. I'm 43 years old, and I have those sort of things where I'm like, oh, I'm staring at mortality going, I literally shouldn't eat that. Wow. Because I could go to sleep and not wake up again. And you, so you were a mad TV or an improv artist, I know that. Yeah, I was, you know, just acting on, you know, stuff. Yeah. Do you feel, were you always an actor? Were you always like a, um... Were you always like a class clown or what were you like? What was, cause some people get in a, you know, comedy, they're class clowns. Some right. people, you know, they're writers and they think of it. Some people, you know, come at it from more of like a creative space. Like what, what was some of your stuff? I was a class clown. Really? Were you a class clown? I was, but just verbally, I didn't do any, you know, I wouldn't, you know, doing anything physical. What do you mean? I would just verbally say something like, you right. know. Like somebody would be like, my mom died. Like the teacher one time was like, my mom died, you know? And I was like, prove it, you know? <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> but I would never get up and like, you know, juggle or show my asshole or, or like, do, like that. Do, yeah, well, class clowns, I don't know if showing your asshole. When we were kids, when, I mean, I've got some years on you, but generationally speaking, when we were younger, it was okay to get up, stand on your desk, and show your asshole. Down, oh, yeah. That would have been funny. Now you're going to have problems because it's just a much more PC. Well, time. we had a dude, Mr. Patrick, he would for, he'd give you 20, 40 bucks. He'd walk about 60 feet from you, show you his asshole. As long as you looked at it, you kept the money. That's fucking amazing. You know? And is that pedophilia? I don't know what that is. That's no. art. That's an ATM. Yeah, that's kind of art. Yeah, that's an ATM, dude. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> I definitely do. That's amazing. That's ass to money, dude. <laughs> you know? But yeah. And as long as he would only look, he'd kind of look back once to make sure you were locked in, dude. That's and fucking I didn't incredible. feel like, it, you know, I didn't like watching him take his belt off, but I didn't mind seeing his asshole from far away. Who gives a fuck? It's just another man's asshole at that point. Back then, pedophiles were pedophiles. Oh, yeah. You knew if it was a pedophile. Yeah, they had a van. They were yelling, I'm a pedophile. Yeah, that's right. I'm a pedophile. <laughs> uh, but a guy showing his asshole from 60 feet away. Yeah, what is that? Be kind of hard to fuck with that in court. Yeah. How far away was he? 60 feet. <laughs> Yeah, uh, prosecution. Yeah, <laughs> He's yeah. approached the bench. He's wasting everybody's time. Uh, <laughs> he fucking showed the kids his asshole. How far away was he? Different times, <laughs> man. Let's have a look at the security footage. Dude, we had a dude I remember in the woods, and we thought he was a um. He said he was a private investigator. He was a um peeping tom. He really was out there for like two months. Yeah. And finally, we're like, oh, this dude's just looking at everybody's ass through the windows and tits right. at night. Right. This dude's just out here hunting single mom fucking nipple at night. Yeah. If you, if you had a, a camera on him late at night, you'd see him prying his asshole open to no one. And that's a real freak. <laughs> that's true, dude. Yeah. And if you went in there and got molested, it was your fault. Because yep. there was one guy and he was in this fucking don't go in Harbor Park towards sunset, you know, sundown. That's where they're doing it. Yeah. That's where it's all happening. Because it was a more innocent time. And I'll tell you right now, I can't think of anything off the top of my head, but if a, if a teacher or a, you know, an educator of any kind pried his asshole open from 60 feet away in Ladner, British Columbia in the 1980s, early 90s, I don't think anyone would have given a fuck. Yeah. Dude, my dad had a friend, and uh, he'd put cinnamon on the fucking palm of his hand and let you lick it off. And this was probably, and one of his feet was longer than the other one, or he had a- What the fuck is the name? Where Extra foot, or where, not, where, he was black. Where were and you? he had like half of an extra foot. So, you know, black Growing people, out the bottom of it? Well, black people are always trying to show off, you know, but he had like a, no. Well, hold on a second. <laughs> he had like a lift on his shoe. One of his feet wasn't that long. Oh, one, of his, one legs. of his feet. Oh, I thought you meant he had, had like two feet stacked like a sandwich. No. Like a foot sandwich with <laughs> no. crazy. Yeah. <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> foot, foot he had a bread two, sandwich. He had a two story foot. <laughs> yeah, a two story foot. Oh my goodness. Just a stack, <laughs> just a Big Mac foot. <laughs> um, my dad had this dude, this guy. And um, he would just pay him to kind of stand around us sometimes. And he, um, yeah, he always had a little bit of cinnamon in his hand. And this when I was young, not every, now there's cinnamon anywhere. There's Vietnamese cinnamon. There's fucking, you know, you could beat the cinnamon out of a fucking Korean if you hit him hard enough. You yeah, know? they got some in their pockets. Sure. Yes, Your Honor. <laughs> I did show those children my asshole, but I was 60 feet away. Coors, the bank <laughs> with beer. Uh, Dude, I met a girl in Miami over by Joe's Crab Shack and bought nine of those gas station, you know, dick pills. This is when they first came out. Bro, couldn't fucking, I couldn't bend my fingers, right? <laughs> And yeah. my nose kept bleeding. Yeah. Jesus. Yeah. Dude, and I was up all <laughs> you night, You couldn't bro. bend your fingers? Uh-uh, any of them. And I would go through each one and try to bend them. You're lucky to be alive. And that then, is fucking... Oh, dude, and my nose was bleeding. I must have lost. I don't know how much, you know how much blood I lost that night, but, um, but anyway, but that was the first time I ever had snow crab. I remember that. Yeah. It's a good thing you remember that, even though your brain was bleeding, <laughs> that you hung on to that lovely memory. The end of the Fucking first season with that electric boat. Did you see that one? Um, no. What happened in that? Am I forgetting how to wear clothes again? I don't know. Damn, dude. Yeah. You look like a, uh, here's what you look like, dude. A panda bear that has definitely been doing crime. <laughs> you know, yeah. like, I'm like going to go steal fucking oh, bamboo dude, definitely, bro. out of the air one. Like, yeah, fucking, dude. Like you look like Voldemort. Voldemort. You look like a dude, Voldemort. But Voldemort? That, that word that goes shopping at a market all the yeah. time. I always Not get the people, Olympian. I only only remember half of people's names. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Yeah, Jeffrey Owens, you mean, the Olympian. Yeah, you mean yeah. Uh, Daniel Claus? No, Santa, Santa Claus. Claus. Yeah, That's right. Different. Hey, have you heard about this new <laughs> this guy Brad Trump? <laughs> hey guys, what's going on with Brad Trump? Uh, you think uh, Mexicans should be deported? How about that haircut of yours, Brad Trump? <laughs> I don't know what happened. I went out there. I gave him my Brad Trump. I got really good stuff on Brad Trump, and nobody. No, it's that you said. You said, it's, you said Brad. It's D Donald Trump. Dude, you do. Uh, <laughs> I've done Scottish before. Yeah, Chris nah, is, nah, nah, nah. Nah, my God, nah. yeah, that's that's Scottish, right? I think it is, yeah. dude. Nah, and he always does this. Nah, my God, nah. <laughs> he has nine legs, bro. Yeah, it's easy to do comedy when you have nine fucking legs. <laughs> piece of shit oh my goodness i didn't say piece of shit they edited that in <laughs> yeah you know i i okay i shouldn't even be saying this uh, on uh 
on wax, as they say. But yeah, I was thinking about doing not the old stand-up character that I was doing, but I've been thinking about doing a new stand-up character. Yeah, like what? I'll, I'll let me let me see what it's like. Well, see, but, I'll try it too. Okay, I'll pitch it because you know why. Pitch I'm gonna, it at me. You know why I'm going to pitch it? Why? Because a, I'll probably never do it, and b, because I I, I feel like it's uh, it's not a bad thing now to pull the curtain back a little bit because we're in the internet age pull that bitch back dude nothing is special the whole family's in the bathtub when you pull that curtain back you see the whole family's yeah. in the bathtub yeah that's what, <laughs> you know? that's what you hope for yeah. when you pull that curtain back you hope to see all, all of them <laughs> yeah. in a line just like like the stickers on the back of a, a minivan just oh, like yeah. all lined up and a dog and a cat doing coke too a lot yeah, of them just doing coke <laughs> just a family doing coke behind that bathroom curtain <laughs> yeah, know, dude. that's what comedy is really do you think about it order me a bag of yams brother you dude, a get slingshot. me some sweet potatoes <laughs> yeah. and a fucking slingshot it's christmas some kind of fucking self-made well, like, we got to talk about christmas too so do the character will okay so the <laughs> <laughs> jesus christ dude all right. I feel like we invited you here to do characters. You've just been talking about all kinds of shit for like talking an about hour. all sorts of nothing. Yeah, dude. I haven't gotten to dude, fuck, a fucking character, man. Juggle or something. I'm calling my the cops. Fucking, my fo- <laughs> Jesus my, Christ. My forearms are sweating. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Look dude. at this, dude. Somebody's going to bake you over the holidays. You got to This is up. wet. Yeah, your fucking arms are wet. Dude. My arms are wet. Are you having man. a stroke? I don't know. What? I fucking took some dick pills at the AM PM. Oh, dude, you I might... figured I was gonna get in here. Might as well get some uppers in me. I fucking I slept here last night. I was in the fucking aisle. <laughs> I had some Najiri, and then this morning I had a fucking turkey sandwich. Bro, I cleaned it's... myself up. Took a couple of fucking rhinos. <laughs> dude, yeah. Uh, oh, you're ready for the so, outback. Anyway, here's my character. <laughs> okay. Fuck me. Anyway, uh, this is literally what I was thinking. Yeah, tell what if us. I, what if I did stand up? Uh huh. See, this is going to be the dumbest fucking thing ever. Well, but still, just get it out. I fucking pitched this to a couple of buddies of mine the other night. I was like, "Hey, man, you know what might be funny? Because they know like the old stand up character." Tell us. No, I got to drum roll it oh so it doesn't God. work. I got to make sure it doesn't work. Okay, okay. I got to fucking just fucking oh. stomp it into the ground first. And I pitched it to them, and they went, eh, "I don't know." So. That's why I just wanted to preface it by saying other people who I respect in comedy, one's a writer, one's a director, not stand up. Never heard of them. Do it. And dude. they went, they went, okay. mm, I don't know. So here's, dude, a fucking here's character. the character. Here's the character. Ready? What is it, dude? A chatty bad Santa? Dude, a damn character. With sweaty arms? Bro, what, a if chatty- you never, what if you never do the character and it just keeps being this? What if I just go on stage and pitch a character and never do it? Yeah. Uh, this fucking podcast just goes in perpetuity through. So, dude, a character, dude. Well, there's I'll really no. For you. There's really. Hey, guys. Uh, I'm going to be in Milwaukee. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's my. Should he fight that guy? Yeah. Hey, BD. Hey, here's my here's my <laughs> BD. Here's here's my Brendan Schaub okay. impersonation. Ready? It's just a couple words. Okay. Hey, Dana White. That's it. <laughs> it's a three-word impersonation. I don't know, hey. B. I don't know. B, listen. Dana White. That's yeah. it. That's my home. Uh, I've never uh, done that for him. Yeah. How many countries are there? Look it up, Chin. Yeah. <laughs> how many countries are there? Hey, Chin, how do I spell my name? Look it up if you don't mind. PDE. Holy Black shit. Rifle Coffee. <laughs> we'll see you in uh, Toledo. Uh, so here's my character. Santa Ana gonna release some special tickets. Where are you gonna be at, Bry? <laughs> yeah. Or how about uh, instead of Hey Dana White, this yeah. is my new. Okay. Listen, Dana White. Yeah, that's pretty good. That's a good one. So <laughs> that's my Brian. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, and then he took out one of my ribs uh, I fucking, and fucking uh, cooked it I right there. I shuck an arm and get him in a fucking weird choke. Uh, 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 BDE. BDE. Hey, Dana White? So that's, here's all, my, there, that's 250 episodes of TFATK in two minutes. <laughs> You want to see that? There you go. Let's do it. Two hundred. Let's do two hundred. All two hundred fifty-two episodes of TFATK in two minutes. We just did it. That's okay, pretty that's good. That's true. Just edit that up, then we'll package that up. Yeah. So, 
And then they get that little redheaded guy in there. That guy who has who knows what, probably a disease. You're or talking something. about Cheeto Santino. Yeah, again. Cheeto Santino, some guy named after a fucking chip. You know, what I I'm didn't saying? watch some I, guy named after somebody that gets dropped off in a van every afternoon <laughs> and thrown into a machine where people put change in and get you out of a fucking chip, bro. Get your life together, dude. Get your life With together. With your fucking cousin fun, you and your boy fucking bugles. <laughs> Jesus oh, how about, Christ. Hey, you fucking cocksucker. <laughs> You're going to fall off the thing. Yeah. Get off the thing, you crazy fuck you. Cocksucker Joey Diaz. That's Joey no, Diaz. No, that's um, uh, when uh, Michael Rappaport's Instagram. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's my impersonation. Fuck it. You listen here, Donald Trump. Okay? God, big stain Donald. <laughs> get off the fucking thing. You're going to drop that dog and get hit by a car. And then that happens. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, I want to talk to somebody. I'm a white, privileged, white guy, Jewish, uh, Ashkenazi, rare silverback Hebrew, and I fucking Porzingis, uh, Carmelo Anthony, you fucking Donald Trump. Da, da. Look at this fucking guy. He's going to jump through this table and hurt himself, you fucking cocksucker. Oh, he fucking fell. I fucking told you. Uh... Here's my character. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, I don't want the character. Do another one and I'll guess who it is, dude. I'll do one and you guess okay, who it is, all right? Okay, let's do that instead. I'll do this one. Uh, let me think of one. Uh, <laughs> what uh, world are these people from? Well, Just we, we only know about four of the same people. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. <laughs> I'm just practicing that. Oh, okay. Just, okay, hold on. I, I you guessed. do one because I, I don't have any. I that that was <laughs> I don't know any. Uh, okay. I mean, I'm quite happy to go, you fucking cocksucker, get out of the street. Now you're going to get splashed with water when the fucking bus drives by. You dumb fuck, you got splashed with water, you cocksucker. <laughs> Dick Stain Donald. Listen. Yeah, yeah, yeah listen. Come you dropped out of the fucking Paris Climate Accord, you fucking idiot, you. Listen to Guy McCrone. You fucking thick skinned piece of shit. <laughs> you fucking. <laughs> you set <laughs> black unemployment down. You're the whitest mother. You're fucking whiter than me, Dick Stain Donald. You fucking. And they look just like each other. You look That's exactly the same. You're my fucking dad. And I'm fucking angry. Their kids went to the same school. You had That's your what I fucking understand. yeah. You had your fucking hair straightened because you don't want to look like me. You fucking cocksucker, you! <laughs> oh my god, dude! Yeah, Rappaport. It sounds like somebody stuffed that movie uh, Casino into a fucking <laughs> into a ginger. Uh, <laughs> That's what it sounds like. It's like what's going on here? Yeah. And also, while you we're at it, dude. Spike Lee fucking sucks dick. I'll say that. That dude's had one good movie and a bunch of bad outfits. If he weren't at the front of the Knicks games, nobody would give a fuck about that yeah. dude. Yeah, you fucking put my fucking money to sleep. I'll put your fucking brain to sleep. And just when you're fucking waking up in a fucking hospital, I'll be there to do it again. Because I'm stupid, you cocksucker, you. Why are you talking to him like that? He's a straight guy. Because I'll tell you why. It's casino. It's casino. <laughs> you went over my fucking head, you <laughs> cocksucker, you. We should reshoot casino yeah. with Michael Rappaport <laughs> and, I don't know, like Brian could play Ace, could play like Ace Rothschild, the fucking, uh, and Brendan, Brendan or Chris could play the Sharon Stone part. It's just rich people yelling at each other, man. Yeah. It's all any of that. That movie is, is fucking, that's some good rich people yelling at each other, though. One of the finest rich people yelling at each other movies. Yeah. I've oh, yeah, seen. yeah. All right, do one more, dude. <laughs> I'll do one, dude. Okay, go. Let me do your character, all right? Okay, do my character. Right. Oh, hey, guys. My name is Patrick, and I was in a train wreck. <laughs> oh, hey, guys. Snack car coming through. <laughs> Oh, fuck. I'm trying not to laugh because it's so hot in here. Is that one? That's a pretty good one. That's Patrick. I'm going to pitch this to you. 
because I want to know your opinion. <laughs> fucking God, dude. I want to go home, pitch this fucking thing, I'm guy. actually going to do We're supposed it. to do Christmas shit, man. This whole thing's this supposed to be about Christmas. This fucking thing was Christmassy. You got that on. I got a fucking hat that's raising my temperature, but I'm sticking with it. I'm fucking sweating through fur. I'm fucking sweating through fur, you, you fucking cocksucker, you. <laughs> Yeah, where were you when I was playing in the NBA six yeah. on six celebrity basketball, you piece of shit? Yeah. You Dick- couldn't beat Amarosa in a one on one, Dick Sting Donald. Dick Sting Donald? You're out here causing all of this traffic. Yeah. I'm fucking well, rich fucking and I'm yelling at you. And nobody showed up to your fucking inauguration. <laughs> you cocksucker, you. Um, okay, so here's the character. Who cares? Why does Michael care so much about it? Ah, well, you got to be passionate. He's passionate about... He is passionate. That's a good point. (laughs) But it's like, why take it out? Like, take it out on somebody else. Take it out on the coach of the fucking Knicks. That guy's been a fucking piece of shit for 20 years. Well, That team's garbage, bro. Wait a minute. You're talking about taking out his political views that he would uh, have aimed at Trump on the coach of the New York Knickerbockers? It'd be a little more... I don't know. It'd be interesting. (laughs) Yeah, just try something different, dude. (laughs) That's definitely different. (laughs) Uh, no, he's politically ranting. People do this. They get yeah, on the internet true. and they fucking, I, I will say that there's, that I love that we live in an age that the internet is still the wild west, that you can literally get on the internet and say, and call the fucking president, whatever the fuck you want. Uh, and That's nobody crazy. can do anything about it. People threaten to kill him. Didn't Madonna say that at like the, yeah, and she didn't even fucking do it. Where are you at Madonna? Yeah. Fucking kill him if you want. Kill somebody. Kill somebody. Kill the coach yeah. of the Knicks. You're a senior citizen that's fucking trying to, you know, fuck, you know. Yeah, speaking of the Knicks, and she fucked half of them, dude. Donna, Maca, Donna. <laughs> what if Chris started dating Madonna? That would be a power move. I wish he would, dude. I wish he would. Because here's the thing. He's got a chance to really hook up with some old senior citizen hotties before they, you know, go to heaven or don't go to heaven. And there's a few out there. Oh, yeah, dude. Jessica Lang. She's yeah, dude, hot. Artie Lang. Artie Lang. <laughs> uh, you know, and yeah, that's uh, it, I think. Artie, Let's Artie see Puffin. the character. Okay, so here's the character. <laughs> okay. It's essentially, it's, it's me <laughs> doing stand-up. Okay. Some jokes, uh-huh. you know, write some jokes, try to get up there for a few minutes. Oh, yeah, definitely, dude. Maybe I might even pilfer some of the jokes from the other character. Yeah. Maybe. Eh, it's a specific bit. Probably not. Here's what it is, though. It's me uh-huh. with maybe a slightly different name and a, a very uh, sh- a very short, well-made uh, wig. I could see it. And it's not one of those things where it's like, oh, why, why can't, why wouldn't he just, we'll just take this stupid wig off and do the jokes. Well, no, this character has his own specific point of view on things about i don't know mostly what it is though is me doing stand-up yep slightly different name Mm -hmm. and a little short short brown wig i could see that i could see you in the smallest wig ever like Uh, like a tiny wig just on the back of my head and i would have a name like pete or maybe philip stanley stanley daniel just something different yeah bunyan bunyan's a good name Bunyan's Bunyan, a cute name for Bunyan, a rabbit. Comma, Paul. I feel like you would have any name that would be cute for a rabbit would be cute for you. And and if I and if I uh <laughs> Muffin, yeah, Cotton, Thumper Jenkins. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there you go. Uh <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, one hand smacking against the other makes a wonderful <laughs> sound for Thumper Jenkins. Yeah, there he goes. Yeah, I asked I know. him for the sound effect for how he's doing like his life. Yeah. And he did a similar thing that you do where he went Oh really? <laughs> Well, I like well, to go. great I, minds think likes, yeah. right? Well, what do you? That's what's the sound effect? Great minds think likes. What's the sound effect for your life, bro? How mine is like? usually it's like like a nineteen forties. Yeah, I know that. I know that the audience can't see it from the back. Yeah, it's, okay. more, it's more impressive from the back. Okay. okay. Oh wow! Yeah. Here comes a fastball. There's another the fastest ball in the West. <laughs> okay. That's the bat. Right. The and ball. Japanese animation. Yeah, J- Japan animation. <laughs> oh, wow. And then, and then it goes where? Hold on. Oh, that is cool. The people oh, talking. Is the ball still going? Boop, 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 boop. Uh, 
Oh, it's it satellite. passing a satellite. It satellite. A satellite. Oh, satellite. Oh, it's a baseball, dude. <laughs> now it's uh, the sun. Is it a fireball. Whoa! <laughs> if you can't, the sun is ninety-three miles, a million miles away. Different angles. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh! It blew up the sun. Whoa! And people can't. Yeah. Uh. Whoa! Like in Terminator uh, yeah, 2. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you see. What's yeah. her face? Linda Hamilton. The, like ah! yeah. <laughs> the guy who was going to catch the ball. Ooh. <laughs> oh, wow. That's What's your, up? That's your right, sound so, effect? Yeah. Yep. That's yeah. an amazing. He's that's hitting it out of the amazing. park. Yeah, no. Oh, I hit it right really? out of the park. That was very visual. So for far that it went to the sun. Audible, audible you told me that you bit somebody's chin off once. <laughs> yeah, I did. All right, well. In a street fight I when I was growing up in Scotland. I don't. See, I don't believe that you in grew the 19, up in Scotland. In the 1960s. You have no accent. When I was 20. Well, I got rid in of the, the accent. I've been here for a while. In the 1960s when you're 20, how old would that make you, dude? Right now? You'd be 65. No, I'm 35 years old. So, uh, not 35. Yeah, this 30. is how we... Sha -na 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 -na. <laughs> <laughs> this is how we do it. It's 1999 and Brian's 50 in 1999. No, I'm not. And Will is only 15 years old and soon they're both gonna be in Hollywood. <laughs> Brian's much older. No, Will is much younger because he's a millennial. Don't be an agent, It man. feels so good. Don't age <laughs> my age. Hood. This is my favorite line of that whole song. All, all the gang bangers forgot about the drive by. What are you Gotta trying to groove on? Why are you trying to make this? Sh it's like, no, they're not going to forget about the drive by. They forget about the drive by. They just put down their gun and pick up the cup and throw your hands up. This is how the party you say. If kind of brought no This is how we do it. <laughs> What a great song. Brian, this is the first time he's ever heard that song. Never heard my life. No, he's never, never heard, heard that song. song. They're out there. They're, 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 they're in cloaks. They're in the forest. And these people are literally having gay sex in coffins. Okay. They're swimming in feces. Okay. Is, is this Alex Jones or is this? And your friend, uh, 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 Joe Rogan, yeah. who's literally... Uh, reading the George Soros talking points, I, 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 and and he said he'd have me back on the show. I don't need to be on his show. Okay, well, and Sundar Pichai, the CEO of Google, yeah, and Google is evil, and you know this because you're part of this exact uh, uh, tra travesty, is what I would call it, and it's a conspiracy on what of people who come to this planet I'm just using it as a search engine. They're bat people and they're lizards. Bat people and and they're not. Human. Okay, do you have any evidence, scientific evidence for this? Do you have any? Let, let me tell you the scientific evidence that I've found of, of bad people, of, 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 of lizard people, of, 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 lizards living among us. And your friend, Joe Rogan. Yeah. Who, and Joe's a brilliant guy. Yeah. Joe's, Joe knows as much as I do. Amen. And, and he's a well read guy. Right. And, and he's, and he's talking about DMT and he wants to start a concentration camp. No, I don't know. I don't think that's true. I've known Joe a long time. I don't he, know where Joe he, Rogan where, uh, lives up in Valencia where he has a concentration. He doesn't live in Valencia. He has a I, concentration camp. No, I can tell you that he With George Soros. That's not true. And, he doesn't even and know he's, George. And, 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 uh, 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 clam. I got a clam. It's just like the story of the scorpion and the frog. Yeah, I know the and story. And the scorpion the, says, yeah. hey, to the frog... Get me across the water. Yeah. And he gets on the frog, and the scorpion stings the frog. Yeah, and the frog, and the frog says, why'd you sting me? And he says, because I'm a scorpion. It's in my nature. You're a, it's in my nature. You're a scorpion. Hey. And, and the, 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 the joke, <laughs> Joe Rogan is a scorpion. All right, well. And you're scorpion people. Thanks, Come Alex. Come to yourself. Part of the furniture. Gonna... Oh, you haven't got much okay. to spare. Who cares? What? I'm only got with you. Yeah. All right, good. So, um, <laughs> uh, I'm going to have to hey, ask you to really, I'm going to have to ask you. Hey, man. Stop. How was it? Australia? It was nice. Yeah? Yeah, have you That's, been down there? No, I've never been Is down it there. possible it's to talk less loud? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're right here. What do they call? They call lobsters bugs out there? Yeah, they do. Well, they're in the they bug family. They, they are the bug, the bug family. Bugs. Shut the fuck up about animals. <laughs> I'm just talking about Australia for Thank a second. You will. And he was Thank so you. happy to go. No, they, they are the bug family. Yeah, they. Oh, why do we call them bugs? Because hey, uh, yeah. Hey, I'm gonna tell you this right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Watch your tone. 
Oh, okay. What's going to happen? What are you going to do? Use some of that <laughs> boxing you've been doing? <laughs> oh, you fucking disrespect. <laughs> hey. Hey. Don't be. Don't. Fuck you. Take, don't put my. Bro. Shut up, Brian. You Will, are you finally sick of a shit? Will? Well, kind of, a Will? little bit. Yeah, I'm right. say what I said to fucking Crystalia. I'm oh, dead serious, man. Yeah. Who, who's that? Listen, if you're feeling froggy, you go ahead and leap, all right? Now, you're looking for trouble, and you're being disrespectful. Downing water? Trouble here. Trouble here. Okay? Trouble here. Uh, let me tell you something. <laughs> what? You remember a while back, speaking of 10-minute podcast, thank you for sitting in for Tommy Blacha, and remember the time that you wrote a letter to Chad Culchin? Yeah. Because years ago, we were working on a project in Chad, and I was training in mixed martial arts. Yes. And Muay Thai. Yes. Let's be... Let's be clear. I'm a, I was a guy in his, you know, mid-30s. Training in Muay Thai. <sighs> yeah. Just yeah. kind of rolling around, you know, just having... My trainer Harold Diamond, you know, yeah, you know, Harold Diamond. And you, would, and you, would, you would kick the bag, and sometimes you would kick the bag, and sometimes Harold Diamond would say that kick right there would split somebody's liver. Would yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, good times. Pro the thing about it is, <laughs> yeah, is I was just like a big, you know, just a big sloppy fat dude in the gym. Don't be that mean to yourself. But keep well, I'm not. I'm a re I'm a pragmatist. I'm a realist. Okay. And uh, you wrote a letter to Chad because Chad said if I had a year to train, I'd be able to put Will in a rear naked choke. And, uh, and you explained to him the difference between a dog and a bear. Yes. You wrote him a, a, a email essay. Wait, he wrote your trainer. He wrote. I, he wrote my so buddy Chad, Chad. Colton, who's a writer and is about five seven. And no, about he's not. He's like five ten. He's not five ten. Yeah, he's, it's a ridiculous thing to say. No, he's about. I'm. I'm I'm going to go, I, I'm a, I'm yeah, gonna go well, with Will on this no, one because you're five, always off five foot, every he's time. He's five seven without question. There's no, no, no. no, no he's about probably about five ten. Okay, let's let's just be and in the middle. Let's say he's what, five nine. He's five nine one seventy one sixty five. Okay, I put him okay. at one eighty five. No, you're uh, stop. I'm just walking, just walking okay. around. You, if you saw me, you mean I mean, uh, and a regular guy. And not an athlete. Not a regular played guy. Some baseball. Yeah, he's, played, yeah, he's a fucking baseball, athlete. Played some baseball. He's a hell of a baseball player. He's a thick dude. He played Continues some baseball to work in high out. school. Played some, and, and he he played guy. baseball up until last year. And, and he said, I think I could take Will if I trained. And I had to explain to him that that just wouldn't happen. So right. you wrote him an essay? So I wrote... Chad do an you essay. Have nothing else to do no, with your I wrote life? him a long essay <laughs> called about the, the dude, dog and the bear. Dog and the bear <laughs> that he posted on his website because yeah. it was it was it the was well received. Dog and the bear. Well dog received. And the bear. And Wait, the guy was dead serious. Thought he could beat. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Chad is always serious. And, and I had to like, take a minute. I, I had have to I, take a I minute. I haven't met this guy. Right? No, I don't believe so. He's a he's a fantastic uh, writer producer, and he his his contention was he wasn't saying this would definitely be what happened, but he said <laughs> he goes oh, I think if I had a year to train and I put on. What, something ridiculous. He said like twenty pounds of muscle. Jesus or Christ! If he yeah, got steroids, like, yeah. no, he's but he's just yeah, and he'd never had any training. So <clears> he's I just said. a big fight fan. You know, he's he's a huge MMA fan, and uh, but he also said he could he could potentially beat a whale in a fight. And so I he's go, hilarious. What do you mean? He's hilarious. Yeah. He goes, yeah. Well, if I got if I got my fingers deep in its eye, I feel like it would be like ah, and then I would kind of technically win the fight. So his point so he was thought he could take Will like in yeah. a year. Or and I had to explain to him that Will is if Will was motivated and strong, Will would um, Will's very hard to hurt for a guy who's never really punched. <laughs> yeah, beat be up. tough. And be a I said also that if Will wanted to, he could fuck him. <laughs> and that was a hard thing for anybody. The hard thing to he hear. said, "You're a prideful man, but you need to understand the way the universe works. A dog ain't beat, beating a bear. A silverback ain't hearing a peep out of a chimp either." Yep. Yep. Not a peep. And did yep. it get through to this guy? Yeah, yeah. Chad said, uh, you know, well, I'm telling you, very realistic guy. I, mean, like, I, yeah, I didn't time. think I didn't I think I would win. Time. But a lot yeah. of this stuff Dove is Dove Davidoff read it fifty times because Dove Davidoff couldn't believe that his friend Brian Callen would take this much time to break down yeah, that is two strange. men. That is strange. But one of the things I always say about you is that when guys when guys who are regular guys who played some sports and have some pride will say well, how how would how would you do against Brendan? And I go, are you asking really how you would do against Brendan? <laughs> and then they go, yeah. yeah, yeah. Why are you asking? And I go, yeah. I go, what you need to know about him, and it's not, it's a hard thing for you to hear as a man, is that if Brendan wanted to fuck you, he could fuck you. Oh, that's great. He's interviewing, I think, Deontay. Ah, 
Wow. <laughs> oh, I had the weirdest leg cramp just then. <laughs> well, dude. Uh, you know, man. Uh, you these, these little chairs, out? man. All right, bro. Uh, these just, little fucking chairs. All right, dude. Well, you know, Brendan fits in them, so just take it yeah, easy. Yeah, Brendan's a big guy, but Brendan's not, you know, Brendan is, is uh, he's V'd out. Yeah. You know, he's he's uh, got the fucking shape in all the right places. He, yeah, he right. does have a bubble ass. Yeah. Well, right? Not, but he's not got, quite mine, but he's yeah. got narrow man hips and yeah. shit, and he's yeah. got those glutes that fucking... Yeah. Come together and just press his fucking no room for his balls. All right, man. Right? That's getting... Just... <laughs> uh, uh, huh? And then those fucking hams, those thighs. All right, man. You're getting, you're getting strangely fucking erotic Christ. about I'm this. I'm just saying Brendan's got a nice fucking set of everything. All right. And he, I'm sure he fits fine. And I see the, the show or pictures of you guys on the, you know, on the set. It's like, oh, everyone looks so comfortable. And then I come here and it's like I'm sitting in coach doing <laughs> a right. podcast. Um, you, can't, you can't fly coach. No, I can't fly coach. You fly first class. <clears throat> I fly. <clears throat> I fly cockpit. All right. I just go in and I sit in the corner of the cockpit. And they and can't go, get you out. I'm good. Don't worry about me. I'm not going to cause any troubles. Yeah. Yeah. And they go. All right. You know, yeah. They just sit there on the ground like a fucking giant teddy bear. You, you still got your bull heart calves. Yeah, I still got huge calves. Yeah, yeah. yeah uh, we're going to stop the you know the illegal flow of blah 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 and everybody loves it because everybody loves impersonations you know i come by here and i do impersonations yeah yeah no i know it's a good time to what do is it. the nicest thing donald has ever said to you uh the nicest thing donald was that we were at mar-a-lago yeah and um i was dining with uh him and ivanka and and melania and the, and the whole family sure baron the boy was eating chicken strips huh and uh and he said he he complimented me on uh how i ate my my caesar salad I what did he caesar say salad. Well, I like the way you eat your Caesar salad. You separate the shrimp from the Caesar salad. I know that you asked specifically for no croutons. You're watching your carb intake. And then you uh, eat the salad first. What's the thought behind that? And I said, it's important. You got to eat your vegetables and your fruits first because they digest a little faster, right? Yeah. So you don't want the protein underneath. Because yeah, if you yeah. get the protein... Just stick in your bowels. Yeah, stick in... And then the, 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 the vegetables will sit on top, and then you get all farty. Yeah, yeah, And yeah. then Baron laughed because I said farty. And he's like, I want you around all the time. You and Baron, you're going to teach him how to throw a football. You're going to be the man I can't be, the father I can't okay. be. Okay. So um, I'm Baron's godfather. And I didn't I, know and that. And I wrote the speech uh, along with Congratulations. Do you get paid to be his godfather? A lot. Oh. It's like the toy. Remember that Richard yes, Pryor I movie? Yes, I do, I do, I do. Kids, watch the toy. Uh, uh, what is the meanest thing Donald's ever said to you? Mm. He called me Chris Christie once when I was coming off his jet backwards. Oh, sorry, he saw my ass and he thought it was Chris Christie. Oh, that's me. He said, "Get back in the jet, Chris, you fat fuck." And I was like, "What?" And he's like, "Get in there, Chris Christie." And I said, Will, Will, oh hey, what's up, Willie baby? And then um, I call you Willie baby. Yeah, we have all sorts of nicknames. You guys oh. got some different different fight styles for sure. I know I'm cruising at about two oh six right now. <laughs> you're not, but bros, wow, probably, you're not, you're little, oh yeah, yeah. You're a little bros, well, probably, bro, bros, you, I would you say, wear two oh six well. Will. Thank you, thank you, <laughs> yeah. thank you, man, yeah, thank you. I feel you. That's lying. all I wanted, I mean, Brian. I, thank you. I feel you're lying by hundred pounds. I'm it one. I'm a pound of what. I feel you're lying by 100 pounds. Okay, man. That's not cool. I'm not I'm lying by 100 pounds. No, no, I just feel you're what? lying by 100 what? pounds. I'm not lying by 100 pounds. No, I'm 206. I'm a heavyweight. Yeah, I don't... I'm a big guy. I'm 206. Why can't you be positive, B? I feel, I, like, hey. he wears, I feel like he wears 206 well. You know, I'm having, I'm, there's, I'm having got a little bit of a salt imbalance problem right now, coupled with possibly a thyroid condition. <laughs> and, uh, you know, I know I'm a little bit of a heavier guy, but I am... I'm sort of. I enjoy savory foods, yeah. and I know I might be a little, a little, a little bigger than I normally am. Yeah. I got to get down for the summer. I got to get, you know, I got to. There's a couple of places I wanted to go on to get, check out. I know you like Bora Bora. Yeah. I wanted to take Kellyanne there. I didn't know about the Steve Perry bullshit, but I'm about <laughs> 206 right now. But I will say, bro, I'm only about bro 30 Greer, pounds heavier than you, bro. Yeah. That's interesting. Yeah. Bre yeah. Brendan looks way thicker around the midsection yes. than yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. You got to give me that. I, I give him that. Brendan looks I way thicker. I feel like you carry two hundred six better than I. I can't yeah. give that to you. I feel like you're yeah. lying by over. We've all played beach volleyball pounds. before. You got to admit. I look a little thinner around the midsection than Brendan. I don't have to I admit agree. that. I'm not going to. He agrees. Nope, you're being. I'm about 206. I know the bro, we were, we were talking about nutrition. He said he's 3% he's, uh, body fat, which I think is interesting because he's 297 pounds. Okay. So he's 6'3", 297. Oh, wow. And 3% uh, body fat. So yeah. I know you can spin kick the fuck out of a boxing bob. And your face. That's stationary. And your head. Oh, I don't know about that. I know that we got some footage coming of Brendan hitting your face with the focus pads. <laughs> I know we're going to see that. We're going to see your face as a target with, with the uh and this is why <laughs> when you are a guy who you know is you yeah. and you're what 
five one seventy. Right, 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 five eleven. Right, be right, careful see, with how you characterize. Doesn't it. matter because okay, you make me mad. You're boxing and shit. And the reason it made me laugh from the bottom of my gut yeah. is that if you ever step to me, give a shit if we're in the theater class. Yeah. I don't give a fuck if we're on a cruise <laughs> yeah, to New careful, York. Careful. <laughs> cruise I, don't give, to New I don't give a shit where we are. Be respectful. Be respectful. <laughs> I'll fold you. Okay. I'll fold you. Yeah. No. Yes, and I'll toss you on no. top of the tallest building I see. No, no listen to me. Don't <laughs> laugh. Have that. a look around. Don't laugh at that. If this there's is... a two story building, the uh, seems here. What are we on the third floor here? Yeah. 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 So this has got three floors. This yeah. place. Yeah. yeah. All the all careful. the places in this careful whole complex. About three. Pretty cool stuff. Yeah. There's lots of great sh- shit outside. Yeah. There's as I was walking in, I saw a food truck. Yes. Everyone was ordering stuff. From yeah. The food it's nice. Careful now. Looks like it's a good thing. Yeah. If we were out there <laughs> and I was in line and I was like, yeah, hi, uh, chicken Caesar, no croutons. And then you walked up and you shoved me out of the way and you're like, three fish tacos. <laughs> and I would just fold you <laughs> and turn you around no. and, and I no. would start spinning. Yeah. And no, I go, no, no. there it is. And it's like, oh, there's one. And three no. stories up. No. Fuck you. You'd wake Don't up with that. gravel rash on the roof, <laughs> just crumpled up against an air conditioning unit. Going, what the fuck happened? Don't say gravel. Your, you'll get gravel rash. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. There'll be, there'll be <laughs> guys up there. Up they'll be up there tarring the gravel. With their hot mops, and you'll go, what like the fuck happened? Style. You got a little, you're hot, it's hot up there, you got some tar on I you, got some tar on you me. got gravel rash, you're a bleeding. A little yeah, just just little bubbly. duty in my pants? Yeah, a little shit, a little shit in your pants. <laughs> Listen, I appreciate what you're saying, and I get it, I'm not a regular yeah. guy, uh, I got okay. a lot of tricks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm fucking, yeah, tricks! I'm, I'm, That's the same I'm, thing as Chad, I'm, I'll get Will I'm in a weird naked down, joke. I've been sitting down on my punches lately, doing a lot of sparring, I'm measuring distance. Who's the guy that I say you could, oh, unequivocally, I always give you props, and I say... If that goes to a fight, an organized fight, and I would love to see it happen, maybe we can set up some sort of charity. I know what's happening. Brian's taking that fucking dude's head off. Who's that? Who, who do I say that about? CM Punk. Okay, I don't know. Phil Brooks. Yes. Uh, I always say that Brian, at 50 years old, yep. you'd be able to fucking, you'd be able, you'd, you'd, you'd give uh, CM Punk a false sense of security. He'd come at you, and then you'd throw one of them box and bob spin kicks like you do on Instagram, yep. and get him into that gravel rash. Okay. You'd get him gravel rash. Gravel right. rash it up. Get okay. him in the hot mops and the okay. black tar. Well, you know nice... he's going to fight again, huh? Probably. Come on. Oh, uh, that'll be fun. That's a nice compliment. Now, yeah. be careful now. So what I'm going to say is, here. I'll kick his ass and your fucking okay, ass. Man. I'll You'll kick throw his both ass. of them, Will? You'll I'll pull fuck both, both of them up? up? Hey, I'll fuck them both up. Listen. I'm, I'll, oh, hey, how about this? Yeah, yeah. Fucking quote me. I'll only fight CM Punk if I'm fighting Brian Callen at the same time. <laughs> what do you mean? Because I want to show people the difference so, I'm just a big. What did Brendan and you, as I walk in here, yeah. here he is, the, the white big Samoan. albino Samoan, the yeah. shaved polar bear. Yeah. Shaved what polar does a polar bear do? Does a polar bear do any? Does he do any uh, mixed martial arts or no, ballet? No, no. Does he do any lifting weights? No. no. What does he do? No. He drags he walruses up onto. That's right. He lives. He hunts and he lives. Yeah. And that's what I do. I uh, hunt and I live. Yeah. And it ain't. It ain't. <laughs> It's a it's a regular day on the ice for me to okay. to drag CM Punk and Brian up out of the water onto my iceberg and just pools and pools of blood. <laughs> pools of blood. Regular day on the ice. Regular day on the ice. I got to eat. Another day on the ice. What am I going to let Brian go because I'm eating CM Punk? No, you got to kill both of them. Regular day on the ice. Well, regular that's what I'm ice. saying. I'll fight CM Punk so long as I'm fighting Brian Callen handicap match. Okay, listen. Two on one. And you guys got to wear matching shit. <laughs> like you're a wearing, fucking tag team. You don't yeah, tell you me, wear matching You don't tell shit. me what to fucking wear. You and CM Punk. No. Hey, Will, what was the tag team where they had they had shoulder pads they had spikes on them oh the road warriors yes. Legion of doom yes yeah yeah road warrior animal and road I'll wear warrior what Hulk. i want oh what a rush i'll we, wear what i want that's what we need you to wear yeah, you see him yeah. no you guys yeah you guys are going to wear but i want you to wear like uh yeah you guys are going to wear spiky shoulder pads but I want the spikes be dicks. <laughs> no. Uh, I want you guys in matching like Killer Bees outfits. No, like B. No. Brian Blair and Jumpin' Jim Brunzel. CM Punk used to be a professional wrestler, and that's what I want you guys no, to wear. I can't move around you just, it's just No, it's just a singlet. You know, it's just little, the shorts. It's striped. Oh, man. Striped with the Killer Bees, just like bees, like black and yeah. yellow. And then, you know, some cute knee pads. And, and then wings just, maybe at the back. Yeah, wings if you want. Whatever, yeah. some B wings. Yeah, yeah just, through, just for the entrance, right? Yeah. And then, uh, and then you guys get in the ring, and that's the only way I'll fight CM Punk. All right. Okay. Is he fighting again? 
Uh, I mean, that's the rumor, yeah. Mm. All right. Good luck getting on one iceberg, though. Big, huge, sloping, shaved, albino, Samoan polar bear. Okay. Now, let me ask you something. I don't give a shit. How much boxing you All do? All right. Hold on. Hey, Did you do some boxing? Oh, cool. <laughs> hey, Will, does anyone, when you're on, because you've been working a ton uh, on set, does anyone, are like, hey, so uh, does anyone talk about fighting or fucking with you ever there? With me? Never. No, no, no. I'm a, I'm a nice, uh, gentle person. I'm a I know, but quiet. you're a big dude, so are people like, no. man. No, 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 no. Never. I have a, I have a quiet, I have a. Nobody uh, cuffs you about the ears? No, nobody cuffs me about the ears. It's a question. No, it's not a question. Yeah. You fucking nobody wait. goes to no, your back you, of your head. You dream of smack smacking me in the head. Hey, you wake up and apologize. Like that, no, don't do that. no, that never happens. You to wake me. up and, and dance around you and dance <laughs> around you and pepper no. your face. No. Nope. Lightning fast nope. jabs. Lightning fast jabs? Yeah. Let's get yeah. in the parking lot after this. I, I would just want love to bring to, the bro. fucking cameras. I would fucking love let's it. Let's get it going. I would Matter of fact, let's get on the it. roof where it's nice do you and mind, hot. Do you mind I'll if take I my pepper shirt the off. outside and inside of your fucking knees with oh, my feet? Why don't you have a look at my knees? Those are big knees. That yeah, might that, hurt my foot. Yeah, that might hurt your look foot. Look at the size of that bull heart for a cat. <laughs> it's a giant cat. <laughs> it's the biggest cat. Hey, you know, I was at the airport. Yeah. And um, I got you something. You got me a gift? Yeah, I got you a gift. Seriously? Yep. This is I was at the airport. All right. Is that a snake? <laughs> there you are, my friend. That's for you, because I, I was at the airport, and I thought you might enjoy that, and I come bearing gifts. Hollywood best woman. Yep. So. <laughs> that was the only one they had. That's the only one they had So left. you got me um, what looks like an Oscar. Mm-hmm. It looks like an Oscar, but it's not. And it says Hollywood best woman. It says best woman on it, and that's for you. Why would you do that? Because I wanted to get you a nice gift from the airport because nice you're gift. having it's a condescending gift. Uh, yeah, and don't do that with your face because uh, you know what I'm saying. And that's weird. Don't that's weird. Don't search. Hold on a second. Uh, Hold on. I don't know if my watch is quite working you don't, correctly. You don't have Last a watch time on. I checked, it was 2018. Yeah. Are you saying that's insulting? I'm just saying that you gave me a. Small... Well, hey, let me ask you a question, Brian. Yeah. In 2017, what would you consider uh, the year 2018? I. I don't know. That would be the what? What would we call that? The year of the woman. <laughs> Just one year? It's the future, Brian. And the future is female. And if you're going to not be a scumbag and you want to be equal yeah. to people like your wife. Yeah. And, uh, you know. And my girlfriend. And your girlfriends and Maya Angelou. And Maya Angelou. And, uh, you know, yeah. and Julia Roberts and people like yeah. that. Yeah. Then uh, you're gonna have to embrace this. So stop being a fucking piece know, of shit. I'm not a Join best us all woman. The... Don't say I'm a best. Woman. Why are you not a woman? How do I, you think? Because I'm a man with a huge hold, dick. Hold and, on a and second. Big, big. Hold on a second. Heavy balls that you... shoot heavy that create a lot of testosterone and semen. Okay, but that doesn't mean that I'm you... not trying to be gross. But that's okay, but my, that doesn't that's my mean deal. But that doesn't mean that you can't be honored and excited by me calling you a woman. Nope, I can. And saying that you're I the grow best hair on woman. I my face and I'm I'm veed out like a motherfucker. <laughs> that I'm may be out like a motherfucker. Yeah, that may be. Yeah, but you're I'm, also all they had left was woman. And I'm aggressive. And you should be happy. I'm aggressive enough to fantasize about punching you in the face until you die. So so are, so, are, so are some women. That's true. <laughs> well, then what the fuck? But I don't appreciate this. You're being. So uh, return this gift to you. You're gonna be, don't give that back to me. If I'm you give, give that it back, back to me, you. Brian, if you give that back to me, I will insert it into you. No. Now, here's the. <laughs> that thing. is, that is I'm an outrageous calm. thing to say. I'm being calm. On fucking camera, Brian. I'm being You'll calm. Insert it into me. Where? All I'm saying is. No, that's not I all you're you, saying. All I'm saying is, I gave you a gift. If you decide to return that gift to me, that I thought you would enjoy. Yeah, careful now. Careful, careful, because I'm going to give you another chance. Because what you just did is... I will, I will take that gift. Yeah, okay. Careful. I'll insert it into okay, you. Okay, man. Okay, Brian? Okay, man. Because that would be I got to say that you And just I still... think you're being a, a fucking no. thought fascist. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. You just said you were going to... You went with your finger, you did a loop, and you push pointed... You, your finger went up in the air, which means that clearly is an indication you're going to stick it right up my shirt. No, shitter. that's not what it means. Then what does it mean? All Where I'm saying, you? you can draw from this what you like. Uh, well, I am. I got you a gift. It says that it's the best woman. It's an Oscar, but not quite really. Yeah. And you should be honored to have that. And it's fucking, and the, the future is female. Yeah, You fine. fucking piece of shit. All right, <laughs> okay? You fucking. You just threatened. And to, if you don't. You just threatened. To, if you don't take this gift, then you're not just a piece of shit. A fucking thought fascist. You're a misogynist. Uh, what you do they just call it? threatened to. Cis you just gendered, threatened to insert this in uh, uh, male. 
And if you try to give it back to me, I'm being very calm when I say this, right. Brian. I will insert it in. That's you. three times that you've threatened. Okay. To to well, essentially take, take fuck me, me seriously. with this thing. Now what I'm going to give it on? back. Mm. I'm going to keep it over here, and, the, and I'm going to give it back to you later. No, I want you to. <laughs> I want you to feature prominently here in your studio is what gonna, I want. That's I want you to build a little shelf no, out of this. No. The guy who makes this is a good guy. It took me a long time to etch that out of You did uh, not make oak. that. Some guy yes, makes a bunch I of those. did it on, in the, in the uh, California countryside. Please ask him for a similarly um, affected and diseased panel of wood that you can screw into there as yep. a little shelf to put your best woman award Get on it. Get your finger out of my face, bro. I'll fucking shove it up your hole, Let's motherfucker. <laughs> I'll shove it right up your shithole. You just said well, blatantly where you're That thing's it. got little creases on the side where it was put together because it was made far away by children with little hands. Oh, and no. those little edges cut. Oh, no. And I'll fucking ram it up your balloon knot. And it'll hurt to shit for weeks if I do that. <laughs> Don't call it a balloon knot. <laughs> you're so aggressive right now. Your fucking little brown balloon knot. Don't call it a brown balloon knot. I would take knot. like, you know, if you took like bubble gum. Yeah. Like chocolate, do they make chocolate gum? I don't know, dude. And, num, num, and I'm chew sure it up, somewhere. and then just take your your nostril and your ear hairs go brink, and then just twist it into the fucking brown gum. And that's that's a replica of my my. That's your shithole. <laughs> and then take that fucking thing and try to put the gum on it like a hat, and you'll bleed. Okay, bro. I'm gonna ask you. Hey, I'm man. gonna do a reset. Yeah. And I you want to start, start over? This, well. No, I don't want to start over, but I do want to start metaphorically over because you're obviously got some problems. Oh. You're this is my funeral song. Yep, this was it. Oh. <laughs> is that it, though? That's <laughs> so stupid. <laughs> Yeah, God, Will, you kill it on this song, huh? Thank you. <laughs> wow, when they start tutting. <laughs> oh, shit. That's my, that's my funeral that's song. That's your funeral song. And Chris and I will come in. Are you guys carrying my, my coffin? We're going to be like my floating body. next to your coffin like this. Am I not carrying in carrying it? We're the Again. only pallbearers. No, that's I want to be wrapped like a mummy, and you guys are carrying me wrapped like a mummy. Yeah. <laughs> in yeah. white, in white. But we're just making you float. Yeah. Oh, I'm, on your, I'm on your, your shoulder. Crying. I'm on yeah. your shoulder. My body's rigor mortis. Your, your wife's crying. And you your wink at her. Your kids are mine. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> no. And then we do that you thing. You wink at my wife with my with me on your shoulder yeah. wrapped in gauze you know uh you know out here in la and southern california they have those <clears throat> sign flippers they have in other parts of the country yeah. where it's like mm-hmm. subway sandwich 5.99 yeah, come brian check out these that. new apartments that's what we do with brian's corpse mm-hmm. at the fucking funeral and we just flip it around and spin in it in the air chicken suits <laughs> yeah <laughs> chicken suits to that song yep, yep. oh that would be a cool funeral uh, brian what do you serve for food money. what do you serve bacon uh, two <laughs> white women are gonna make burritos bacon. there you go there you go. There you go. Two fucking white women who went to Mexico are super foodies. Hey, you know what? Let's start a restaurant. Design People fucking burritos. loved it. Yeah. And now it, the old. Just, just while flipping Brian's body with chicken suits on. While white women make burritos. Yeah. Wife crying so hard. Yeah. And, I'm, and your kids are on my shoulders. Why are they doing this? And then I bust out of the gauze and I'm like, psych. And I cut both your throats. Okay. And I drink your Uh, blood. No. Too much. Um, Go on. Uh, But here's my thing. I love meat. It's great. I've taken um, I've taken time off of it before. I did two years of just uh, pescatarian. Really? Yeah, yeah. Ju- which is just you know fish and vegetables. I yeah. did that for two years once. That's the longest that I've done do that. You grow I'll do it for. Do you, do you grow a pussy? I'm sorry, sir. What was that, Brian? <laughs> did, sorry, <laughs> nothing. Keep going. Yeah, but you did you you shared some sort of joke and then you laughed super and well, like like and did you pump your fist well it's just pretty cool I was okay like, well anyway i was eating seafood and vegetables ah, mostly yeah did you start yeah. wearing dresses one more time please what was that <laughs> nothing man keep going keep going it's all good it's all good yeah what were you saying 
I avoided uh, most bottom feeders. Uh, shrimp was probably a little too fatty. Yeah. Things like clams and oysters, I didn't have much. Oh, yeah. Mostly uh, uh, white fish, uh, white fish oh, yeah. uh, well, things like that. You get your period. <laughs> Excuse me, Brian? What? Did you, what? Did you make some sort of no, what were you mention saying? of... of uh, no. Is that some more? Is that some of that bro humor saying I'm I have just a period talking out loud? What's what are you talking about? Oh, I was just telling you about my eating habits because you wanted to have a real. You said you were having. You lived on. Yeah, but you. But then you said something. Vegetables. You said I'm listening. And I heard I, you say pussy dress and period. I heard you say that. Huh? I I I heard you say what? Pussy. Yeah. Dress. Huh. And. Period, when? as in menstruation. Okay, I don't know when. Maybe. What do you mean? I don't know. <laughs> I don't. I'm talking. Well, if you want to have a real conversation, I'm you having can't a do real that. conversation. And other times, I actually just you know went vegetarian for a little cool. while, but I felt like Did you wear a bows was... in your hair, in your ribbons. <laughs> you know what, dude? What? <laughs> what? Whoa! Hey! Hey! hey. <laughs> No, no, don't do it. Don't do Will, it. Don't do it. Will, hey. no. Oh. Hey. Ah. Hey. Ah. Hey. 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 No, no, not that. Ah. Ah. Feel the new belly button. Oh, man. man. It's good. It's funny. It's really funny. <laughs> Who makes these jeans? Ah, that's my penis. No, no, I'm asking and I can measure distance, and you would boom, kick, boom, boom, and you would boom, overstep, boom, and then your boom. fucking face would be here, and I would go, bang, bang, yeah. bang. Yeah, yeah. I'd go well, boop, 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 because yeah. I understand combinations. Boop, boop, yeah. whack. And hey. then you'd go meh, meh, meh. And okay. then you'd shit your pants. How did you um, shit your pants and have to run away? All, he's all fucking hurt. Yep. There they are. That's and then after I got off stage, picture. everybody was like, picture. when I got off stage, everybody was like, let me, let us be in your movie. No, let, no, no, no. Be in our movie. We love you so let much, Brian. Your you're movie. the, you're what the movie? best. What uh, movie? Hey, what movie? I heard you're, what, what movie are you doing? You doing Man Quest yet? For years, you've been talking about shooting Man Quest. No, I got busy, Will. Yeah, but what about Man Quest? I got busy though, you know. So yeah, I but you've chose been not... talking about Man Quest for years. Yeah, I know, man, and I'm still working. You guys on know it. about Man Quest? No, I, I'm working audience? at my own pace about a guy who become goes from boy to man. You know, that's something I'm working on. Boy to man? Yeah, and I don't need you. I I don't need you mocking my process. I'm not mocking your. Fuck, first of all, you don't have a process to mock. Hey, I know. <laughs> no, you don't. You don't have a process to mock. Yeah. You just fucking yeah, I do. Do, 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 <laughs> that, do, do. That's not how I go through life. The Goldbergs, and then you. Oh, this is you. This is you getting. This is you. Careful. Th they're like. Don't hold be, on. I'm going to tell you. I don't but be, I'm going to talk about your process. All right. Okay. Let me but talk about your process. Be respectful and be honest. I'm always respectful and honest. That's you're like not. you're someone who's like. But I can feel. This like, is what you do. You go like, hey, honestly, let me tell you. So you're going to preface this by saying honestly, which means the rest of what you're saying is bullshit. <laughs> That's you, Brian Callen. Chin. Uh, sorry. Yeah. Here's here's you. You're doing the Goldbergs. It's going great. And they're like, oh, we're thinking of spinning this character off. And we're thinking about doing schooled and blah, blah, blah. And yeah. here's how you uh, add to that. Ooh, ooh, and you fall into it. You fucking And that's asshole. your entire fucking career. No, it ain't. Ooh, no, it ain't. I wrote, down ooh, all my, I wrote down my dream board and I, I can show it to you. I bet your dream board is a cork board in your bathroom and it's got three pictures on it. Yeah. There's a fucking a canoe in a lake. There's a fucking pair of suede shoes. A little red chair. Okay, why? And that's what you got. Why would all that be on my dream board? Because that's all you got going on up here. I, I got a canoe in a lake. What? Because yeah. I feel like I'm a canoe on a giant lake. No, you're like, I want to go out in nature. Want to in nature. <laughs> and then uh, you want to, and then you want, and then you like so, my so shoes. So nature, so nature is one of my goals. Yeah, fucking going out in nature, which is someone you just, you're, you're going to be hiking out there. Amongst the, the roots and rocks, and you go, ooh, and fall in the water, and you yeah. wish you had a canoe. You better shut up, or I'm going to fucking punch you in I'd the face. I'd love to see it. <laughs> Don't. Dude, you I'd flinch. Love to see it. I didn't flinch. <laughs> oh, Dude, you flinch. Okay, well, I've Do you got, know what that means? I've got some if PTSD. If I you, I'd flinch. <laughs> I mean, oh! The real one. Listen, real man, don't I'd do that. I'd flinch for the one, and I'd come at hard with no. the two. Man, you I told like, you not to do that. You don't know that. how to defend yourself. I do know how to defend myself. Uh, uh, dude, uh, dude, you're not defending yourself at all. That's not going to help. Kicking your... 
Dude, I'm coming. I'm hitting you. I keep hitting you over and over. I'm Amanda Nunez in the back. Oh, shit. That's not true. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. It stinks in here. Jesus Christ. That actually that? works. Oh, that oh. came out of me? Dude. Oh, man, you scared me. Oh. Dude. You scared Dude, me. Dude, you just got out of it as a serious coward. Yeah. You got like- you just out, got out of it as a fart farting coward right now. <laughs> That's not good for my rep. No, it's Why not. Why would you do that? Because I didn't know that you'd be a fart farting coward if I came at you. Yeah, but I want, look at me adjusting in this fucking chair, Are man. going now? Is this the podcast? Yeah, we're going now. Hey, everybody, welcome to the man. <laughs> Fighter's not here in the kitchen. Nope. Hey, nope. we got a great show for you. We're going to be talking about some mixed martial arts. All right. Well, the lifestyle sexwin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sexwin. Yeah, sexwin. All right, yeah, sexual sexual lifestyle <laughs> section, and it's sexual. With All Brian right. the Kid Callan. All right, he drop some knowledge. <sighs> All right, well, listen, I get this from Shab. Hey, Will, have fun taking my spot today. If Callan tried to talk politics or something super boring, you have my permission to sock him in his old fat dick. And now I go, hey, and then Sasa goes, do you mean to say that when people approach today's wide media landscape seeking political coverage and opinions that they shouldn't count T Fat K as a clear option? I mean, how are people going to get their news if old windbag McRegurgitate von something he heard doesn't play moron Anderson Cooper with your listeners? Whatever, dude, it's your show. I'm like, Will. And then. And then Shab goes, Will for president, Callum for sucking dick. Really mature. <laughs> and then I go, you got to take this back, guys. And then good. I get this from Will in quotes. Hi, my name is Jimmy, and I love the fighter and the kid. When I look for opinions, I can trust today's fast-paced news cycle. I listen to Brian Callen or one of my dad's friends who does whatever for a living and watches Hannity sometimes. Then I get, Brian, I'm taking a shit and getting an Uber. Give, give you an ETA soon. Yeah, I was, How at, I was at the airport. How you want me to show up? I showed up. That's my commitment to your list. This is the sort of shit that people are. It's crazy that man. people are dealing well, how about, with. How about not you? No. Not you because no. you're you're when more at the Dutch, dog park. No, same I'm thing happened to Brian. You're more Dutch no, I'm not, than Elizabeth Warren. Dutch. I'm not Dutch. Brian, the same that, thing I'm happened. Saying, I'm sorry, I got a little. No, you don't do that on my own show. Hey, I'm sorry. Don't do that on my own show. I'm just trying to make a point. Keep pushing the mic into my face. It's super disrespectful. You are very. Hey, what the fuck, bro? More air. That's four times. I'm warning. Not a fifth. You've got. You've got. I bet you've got. Not a fifth, dude. Hey, dude, don't you've do it. You got fifth. blonde hair like Stormy Daniels no, has don't. on the top of her head. <laughs> no, I don't. In your anus I'm stuck. because you're Dutch. <laughs> you're fucking Stormy, Dutch. Turn on the Jock Jams. Jock Jams. Jock Jams. I'll tell you what they're going to do. They're going to have to grow like, you know, they're going to have to take her earlobes off. Does she get the kind of eyelid surgery that I want? Um, no, <laughs> I don't think so. I think the one you want, you want to take a little more off the skin. The I want to take a little skin off the droopy skin. Yeah, I'm taking Nah, that's good shit. It makes you look like a fighter. No, but I am a fighter. The fighter or the fighter yeah, podcast. I'm, I'm, I'm fighter. No, you're not fighter. No, I'm you, fighter. you hop around a gym mat with guys. You pay. <laughs> you pay them. Hey, I'm a fighter. Here's a hundred dollars. Jump around with me for an hour so I can punch things. Well, mm, fighter. Well, you got my. You know what? You know what kind of. You know what kind of fighter you are. The fighter Careful. who has a hundred dollars to Ground's give to coming. someone. Ground's coming. Hey, fast. would you hold Ground's a bag fast. for me to punch? Yes, I will. Pull your How shoe. much? Pull that your will be one hundred dollars. Pull your fucking shoe. Here it is. Pull your shoe. <laughs> I'm not okay. pulling no fucking Turn shoe. Turn the wheel because the wall's coming. <laughs> That's me heading right to the ground no, like a no, bomb. No, no, I'm not no, worried. Pull your shoe. I'm not worried. Pull your shoe. Pull your <laughs> <fucking> shoe. <laughs> I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Don't, 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 don't right take now. my head off. Don't call me a headless cat. Okay, motherfucker. You got real you, close that time. Dude. That <laughs> asshole talked about this for too much or that for too much. Yeah. I'm perfectly fine to let you drive. Yeah. <laughs> and, don't, uh, don't, don't no, I was be just, condescending, though. <laughs> no, no, I was thinking about something that no, I saw on TV. No, you were laughing <laughs> uh, at the idea of me. No, driving. no, no. Because no, like, you're already trying to be the alpha male in this. In no, this no, 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 no. no, I don't. That's That shit either comes naturally well, or it doesn't. <laughs> okay. Don't fucking. I'm, um, I'm an alpha, too, so that's the thing. Well, don't. Yeah. yeah, but don't. Look but what I, you're doing. You know what? Because I, I don't get, like your body because, language. Because I'm not I can afraid, sit up, too. I'm not afraid to fight you, and I'll say that right now. Look at you. You're sitting. You got. You need your don't, knee under you don't to, get, nudge my to fu- get you up. Don't touch my You don't my have person. a big man ass like me. Okay. I got a big, fat man ass. Oh, God. Yeah. What What do you do with that? Well, my big, fat man you ever ass? Ha- you ever have a girl? Be honest with me. You ever have a woman? Because I know you. See, you get, you get girls sometimes that like their big man. They like a big man. You ever have a woman... Get get just work work your ass. Work my ass. You know what I asked you. 
Yeah, I've had women like stand on my ass. Yeah, what else? You ever, you ever have a girl just knead it like dough? And say, yeah, like, knead it like dough. Man ass. Just get down and knead it. Yep. Or, uh, you know, hold the edge of the... I have a very regal looking bed, so the uh, head, the know. headboard is very regal and it goes up and there's... <laughs> There's there's leather, there's okay. wood, very regal. Don't fuck that noise. That word, and, uh, noise and they'll hold it, and then they'll just you know geisha my ass with they their geish, feet. They geisha. Yeah. And if I get ass? too relaxed, then you know oh. <laughs> a little size five. Oh no! That's As I shit. get older, even though I look thirty five, and we know that, and you I look hear like that it. all the time. Yep. You look thirty five, and you move like you're thirty five. You look. You like, move like you're yeah. thirty five. That's important because because. Cause and you don't know what that's about, but I my body does whatever I tell it to yeah. do. You whatever look like I a weathered thirty five year old. Would you put up the a picture of the singer of uh, of the Pogues, Ian McKellen? <laughs> I know what you're is it about Ian to McKellen? say. Yeah, it is, and I and I'm a fan. Oh, Shane McGowan, whatever Shane McGowan. sounded. Yeah, Shane so McGowan. these pictures Ian are McGowan. all of these are all pictures of Shane of McGowan. Yeah, he's a heroin addict. Roughly thirty five years of age. Yeah, he had some problems. So with you look teeth. like yeah, he's got a few. There he is. So he, you know, he mixes them up. He has a shandy with breakfast. Yeah. He's got I'm some sure. issues with when it comes to. He's had some big. Well, he's been drinking. Yeah, and heroin. Is McGowan. A, he's a fan of heroin. He's a Scott. I guess he's a Scott. He's got no fucking teeth. Yeah, Look but he's thirty. Mouth. He's probably twenty-seven years old there. So wow. I could see how you could. Get, I saw him live for, in a. I think it was CBGBs in New York City. And he came out so fucked up, but goddamn, I love his music. Yeah, he's yeah. He's a real fucking poet. Yeah. Look at those teeth. Shane. Shane. Those are bad teeth. Those are real bad teeth. So anyway, you're 35 looking? He, and you know why his teeth <laughs> kept falling? He would just fall flat on his face after getting What are you talking about? His up. teeth are rotten because he's drinking. All right, man. All he's know. doing is drinking. He needs new he teeth. He would fall flat on his face. All right. He had these perfect pearly whites, and then I he fell on the cobblestone street. I don't know. And he's not, it doesn't, it doesn't tell totally This is how you do the internet. This is how you do the new media. Get the likes, You got to involve bro. everybody. You got to get the likes. Do it for the gram, bro. Do it for the gram, bro. Do it for the gram, bro. Do it for the gram. Brian's Instagram is the only Instagram that is a full-length television show. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Yeah. Every what do we got? One minute. Here's one minute. All right, dude. And you know, didn't Delia talk about this? That it was did no. he f- fill in a minute? I've heard it. Oh, I, don't I, know. Had Maybe to, I had to do that one where he just sent me that. Hilarious. I didn't yeah. fucking see it. Shut the fuck up. I'm <laughs> referencing were... Chris, who we, we know and your audience knows, of course. Uh, well, not well, well, a specific Instagram. Have you seen this one? <coughs> yeah, I've seen all those. No, the last one. Boy, I look more and more like this my, one? my nose seems, seems to get getting, getting older, Bubba. Well, it's getting very big. You're getting older, nose. Bubba. Yeah. <laughs> Get over, That's Bubba. an old man right there. <laughs> your, your hair's the frog and life's the pelican. If, if they give you, if Instagram increased it to two and a half minutes, your videos would be two and a half. You do thirteen minutes. <laughs> he yeah. would do thirteen minutes. He would just talk until, and it's like, you know. And now I'm heading over to, and that's how they stop. <laughs> yeah. Because he's just talking I until it ends. You're the only person Careful. who also Careful. uses the 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 camera yeah. in it. And just records right on the app and then sent. Like, there's you know, no editing. No, there's no, like, busy, there's no like recording bro, on I'm the on camera. Two shows. I don't there's no two takes. It's no, just the just, one take. Just the, oh, he opens Instagram. No, come on, man. He That's talks into it no, for a unfair. minute. And then he hits send. No, he'd be being unfair. My well, eyes. I got to get my eyes pulled up huh, a little bit. Yeah, let's. My I, I would like away. to watch set that. You <laughs> some eyeballs. I mean. I'm not mad at your uh, eyebrows, though, bro. It's the one Subscribe thing. Fantastic. More than that. I'll fucking smash your nose with that. <laughs> no. no. So go on. Good luck, because I, uh, I have a good head movement. Now, listen. I'll take three shots. You can miss the first two. Mm-hmm. You are not going to. All right. What's this thing? Oh, you can catch that in the head. I'll, I'll answer back to and catch don't, that in the fucking head. Don't I'll lift say, that up with one hand. Don't fucking threaten to cave my I'm head. I'm not in threatening with... anything. All Finish right. your story. All right, you historical ignoramus. I'll smash they... this. All right, thing. Fuck hey, this guy got in touch with me. The man who made this. Yeah. Wonderful artist, and he's going to make another one for you because I'm going to break that <laughs> into two perfect pieces on your nose. Fuck. fuck. Finish fucking your story. The beginning of the end. This is the problem. You got to trust Brendan. Just let him do whatever the fuck he's going to do. All right. By the way, the o- the only reason you're sitting here in this place right now is because of Brendan. So you don't we'll say him, that. And the you take that. only reason you take that back. Oh, right? I have proof positive why it's the only Wh- reason. Why? Because you and I had a podcast for years. <laughs> Okay, True. and I'm still doing it. Guess where I'm doing it? Yeah. In same fucking room well, in my house you know, that Brendan, I've been doing. Yeah, you're right. Brendan will rent the space. He'll have an artist come in and paint yeah. this. He'll get chairs. Yeah. 
He's a nut. Right. And and over at my house where we do the 10 minute podcast, by the way, tune into the 10 minute podcast oh, every it. Tuesday and Thursday. It's a 10 minute show. Myself and writer producers, Chad Culchin and Tommy Blotcha. It's very fun. Two of the absolute funniest, irreverent and thoughtful, intelligent guys I know. Okay. A little bit of a departure from no. the way it used to go. No. But I'll tell you, it still smells like your your farts in these, fo- in these foamies and uh, on know. the mic. And, well, uh, no, Shab is a Shab is a businessman. Yeah, he's a nut. We're, we're and, and also he has that he has that that you and I don't have. He has that pro athlete sustained intensity. That's sus- <laughs> that sustained ferocity. Yeah. and that need to dominate other podcasts. Yeah, like his, that's interesting. By the way, I incredible. do want to talk about this when. Well, whatever. You know, I'll say it now. Excuse me. Oh, I drank too much water. Hold on. Water, water I just burp. need to wash that water, water down. No. I got to wash those burps down with no, the water. Don't, Hold please. on. It's a vicious cycle. I'm addicted. Love, Hold on. For the love of God, don't drink another glass. Boy, oh when boy. the structure is compromised, it falls in on itself. That's too much. That's why um, the World Trade Center didn't fall over. They're like, it could have been, it had to be detonated because oh, that's the way it falls. Did it? They put, did they put charges in there? Is that what the no, CIA no, no. did, guys? I don't know. Uh, no, you that. can see. Or did they do that? In, or did uh, maybe Alex Jones has a, a theory on. On the Mexico earthquake, they make a fucking frogs gay. <laughs> yeah, did the CIA do that? Did they? Did they rig? Explain the- Tower Seven. Yeah, they got. They got the dinosaur- Hillary's a lizard, I'm- and she took Tower Seven and put charges in it. Yeah, and they make a fucking frogs gay. All right, take it easy, Alex. Well, why don't you tell me why the Tower Seven fell on its own? Well, if you're so, I'm here with a Navy Seal. Well, you're I'm the here Navy with a. Seal. I'm a Navy Seal. That I, is so spot on. I I am I, I'm a Navy SEAL. I I own eighty seven dogs, and all of them were trained by Nate. And when I was the governor of Minnesota, I had over a hundred dogs. Now, what say you to that? Well, if you're such a patriot, I don't know. You what, know how the nine eleven? Uh, ha, you know what happened? What's that have to do with your dogs? I guess you Jesse? must have been there. I wasn't. I guess you must have been there. I wasn't. And th- Nate would tell you that a press of canario, that six press of canarios could uh, don't say take down a building because that's not factual. I was not going to say that. Right. I was going to say they could. Four of them could take out a nuclear submarine. That's not true. We had them doing it in the Marines. I don't know about that. I you was said, a Navy SEAL. I know you were. You said now, that. I live oh. in the Baja. All right. And I don't, I, I spend less than six months a year in the continental United States of America. <laughs> I have a thousand gallons of potable water. I don't know what there, you're saying. And you I just... have a silo full of tortillas. Okay, but what is the point of what the, what is the well, point? Well, why don't you tell me? I don't know, man. You you're, tell me. Why just, don't you tell me I, what the point is? I'm trying is, to follow. If you're such a patriot. I am a patriot. But you know what? Just because yeah. you have a silo full now of Now you want to show us pictures of uh, shaven sh- and shorn chimps. And, you, and you've never stepped in the, in, the, uh, in the arena of battle with a chimp. And when you I do, never said I, you'll be thumbing your ass for sure. I, because I, I have gone in hand-to-hand combat with many chimps. You have? Armed, yes. Armed only with a polar bear femur. And when, that's something you don't know anything I about. I don't believe because you. Because I'll be over there in Da Nang, and I'll be over there on the Ho Chi Minh Trail. There are no chimps there. And, there and no I'll take in... the chimps in with me while you're over here taking patty cake lessons. I'm not... With, I, with your boxing The Vietnam coach. War is over. And... The Vietnam War never started. <laughs> what? What? What did she just say? I said the Vietnam War started so that it could you never said end. It never started. So it can Why did I never said that? You, I don't know. Why what, don't you tell me what I said? I don't fucking know. I'm trying to you follow tell you, me. Jesse. I'll tell you what I said. What did you say? I said the Vietnam War was started by chimpanzees. <laughs> That is factually it's, incorrect. It's factually I can true. Tell what you would 100% you know? That's Why don't you tell me what I happened? am telling you that you that's... You weren't there. Why? I, I, I watched Nixon sign an order. So what did the chimps do? They started the war? I wrestled Bob Backlund for 45 minutes in the Philadelphia Spectrum. <laughs> well, fine, but that doesn't to make To a draw. You, it doesn't make so you So why right. don't you tell me how All I All right, know. you know what? Get him out of here. <laughs> All right, fine, I'll leave. Bye-bye. I'm God going damn, back that to guy's... That guy's so hard to follow. What the fuck is he doing? In I don't here? know, man. He's the just fuck Jesse Ventura just runs in here and fucks your podcast up. Yeah, he doesn't. He's in control. This is no a, sense. Yeah, well, there's security here for a reason. Well, he's but, huge. So what are you gonna yeah, do? He's a big guy. But, yeah. You know, all right. Anyway. All right. So, anyway. Sorry about fuck that. Fuck how guy. big you are when you take the the butt of a shotgun to the face. You're gonna drop to your knees, and that's something <laughs> you've never <laughs> felt, oh, Brian Callen. God, what is and he doing And I know here? a thing or two. I've I've served with women in the Marines. I you said you were in the SEALs. 
Right. I was in the Navy SEALs. Okay, but you said the Marines just Well, now. I did not say that. That's not what I said. You just I said, said that. that I no, I had a you. secret I had a secret team of a dozen women and me. I don't think And we so. would go yes we would and we went to Cambodia together. And then What did you do in Cambodia? We took out the enemy and then we had sex. We had sex. Well, have you ever had a thirteen some? I've never had a thirteen. I have. All right. You're well, not a patriot if you haven't had a thirteen some. I don't think that's a with good measure. Twelve of a Navy SEALs built like Linda Hamilton, and I'll tell you another thing. What? They sure did cock my shotgun that day. <laughs> okay, we, can I gotta, we get Jesse? You got to get out of here. All right, I'll we're leave. doing current I'll, events. Fine. Bye bye. Man, can Jeez, we, somebody is. please lock just, the door so he doesn't don't let it, don't just tell them at he's the a giant they don't they're not going to stop you're not going to stop him with a fucking he's picture also a celebrity a little he's a fucking, piece of paper that says you're recording in here. he's the governor of minnesota he's yeah. always going to stop the governor all right this is so crazy because it's our first well, shot side fox and donald trump just walked in and uh i cannot believe I, this. I, I, we, we, we needed a big sasso. guest we need a big guest yeah and will yeah. sasso was like i want to do the show and i was like dude but donald trump's coming in though he said there was going to be a surprise uh hi president-elect donald trump hi, uh, welcome uh to, i can't believe this. how are you is this well, your first this is, tr- this is tremendous oh. i love being here i love yeah. the fighter and the kid Thank it's you. one of my absolute favorite uh broadcasts yeah and um, I think what you guys are doing is tremendous. It's terrific. A thank couple you. of great guys, by the way. You, thank terrific you. you look great, man. Thank you. Terrific Congratulations. Guys. Well, uh, thank you very much. Uh, you know, we've been on the, we've been on the campaign trail. We've been doing rallies. Uh, 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 I want to do rallies. I'm going to keep no. doing rallies. Well, that's Pence no, you don't gonna, need to anymore. Well, I'm going to keep doing them. I was doing six a day, sometimes seven. Donald, can I ask you a question? Were you surprised that you won the election? Because you were no, behind. No. Okay, but you were. Excuse me. Yeah, but you were Go behind. Ahead. Excuse but me. You were behind, though. Uh, so. No. No. And that's. The polls I think, were wrong. The polls were wrong. Brendan is right. And yeah. the polls are wrong. Mm-hmm. But, but, and if you've heard me say this before, I've said this before. Brendan is right. And the polls are wrong. I believe I've said yes! that. Yes. I've yeah. never heard you say that. I've said that many, many times. The CNN. thing is, you know, the corporate news monster wants you to believe this and that. They want you to believe that I'm a crazy guy, that I'm somebody who's... Uh, uh, hey, uh, man, Donald, Donald. Find the word, Donald. Uh, Donald. Donald, uh, can I just interrupt you? Uh, you do and you excuse have... Excuse me. There are a lot of people... Excuse me. There are a lot of people that are disenfranchised in this country. There are a lot of... Uh, people well, dreamers. look at Hillary. I mean, look at what Hillary said. She said they're deplorables. No, no, no. That, that's not what I'm talking about. But they're. <laughs> that's they're another word of, that starts of, with D. I know, but a lot of gay. It's got a lot of syllables. A lot of gay. Everybody Americans. loves my vocabulary. No, nope. well, I have some of the best syllables. I, uh, people know this. Probably, but, but Donald, look, the, uh, a lot of gay Americans, uh, Black Americans, uh, Latino Americans are worried that I love you're them. not going to speak people. for them. Terrific people. No, that's not true. Right, but that's not true at all. I've got a, a plan. Yeah, we're going to make America great again. It's no, going to be I'm fired up. Say that. I'm it's fired gonna, up. Man. Thank you. I'm Brandon. fired up. About now, are you, you still much. grabbing people by the pussy? Well, no. See, now that's not exactly true. A lot Brandon, of people that was a thought very hard that. Question. Well, you know, he's he's like asking. Be, I'm like him. Yeah, I'm excuse me, Brian. Yeah. Excuse me. Brendan's asking me straightforward questions. No, the truth of the matter is that when. Those words were said. It was actually Billy Bush who said that. No, I, I, that's I not knew true. it. No, 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 Brennan. Billy no, Bush is the bad guy. No, that's not true. No, Donald. He gave I knew ten it. million dollars to one of those charities that they had on the John Oliver show. I don't know. I couldn't <laughs> even figure it out. There were so John, many, so many. He's a pig. That he put on. He's a pig. John Oliver. No, 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 no. John Oliver is a pig. No. Billy Bush. He's a British. Billy Bush. Pig. No, Billy Bush is a tremendous guy. He's a great guy. Now, have what? You... John Oliver now, it... is a British. Pig dog. Okay. Oh, wow. And that's true. And he went on his program, very unfair, very sad. <laughs> okay, very, but I, I, Excuse I, I... me. Excuse me. Very unfair. <laughs> he went on his program, and he said, eh, eh, oh, he said, well, he said, who? He said, oh, no. that, oh, oh, <laughs> eh, okay. he, excuse me. He said that everybody should give to charities, that this is not normal. What? Well, I think, excuse me, I think this is a sp- <laughs> spitting in the face of... America. D- we're going to make, excuse me, we're going to make America great again. There's a lot of disenfranchised How? people who work. And you a, a lot plan. of gays work. And gay a lot work. of them have jobs. Of course they yeah, do. Yeah, of course. They're yes. normal. Yeah. Right. People. Even gay people. Okay. Well, yeah. And they have yeah. jobs. Okay. And black people. And, black. and, what about and the, the Mexicans. Wall? What about the wall you're talking about? We're going about? to build a wall. 
Who, who be... do you not like, Donald? I like everybody. What no, about? Well, I don't. I know. like everybody. Are, are you still gonna do some stuff with the WWE? Like, you're gonna still? Uh, Vince and Linda are tremendous friends of mine. I love Vince and Linda. Uh, I might give Linda an ambassadorship. Um, what would you say to the people that didn't vote for you, Donald? Look, we had a lot of people on the other side. This is about us. This no, is about I, I getting that, everybody. What... To, excuse me. What? This is about getting everybody. <laughs> but what would you say together. to the people that didn't that don't don't like you and are taken to the streets? It doesn't Did you matter. Watch does Saturday it? Night Live. I. I don't think Don, so. Um, Dave Cheadle did not vote Don, for me. Don Cheadle. Don Cheadle did not vote for me. He did his monologue. And no, when that Dave, was, no, that wasn't. That was Dave Chappelle. Dave Cheadle. Dave, Dave Chappelle. Chappelle. Uh, he said that he, did, he didn't vote, but he's going to give me a chance. And I love Don Chappelle. Oh, and Dave. I think he's a tremendous... Dave. It's Dave Do you have Chappelle. a tissue? Over here, Brennan needs Brennan a tissue. Spilled. I've spilled a wa Brennan water. Spilled. A tissue. Brennan spilled. Maybe a little. Oh, it's, it's kind fine. of running down right fine. here oh, a little bit. Oh, it's I guess go. it's fine. It's, it's going to. It's fine. I guess it's fine. Brennan is trying to. I think he's trying to get me off that. You have a little tissue right there you can use. <laughs> there's a little. For some reason, there's a. There's a roll of toilet paper in the studio. <laughs> I don't know why. What could, sort of questions you're asking here? Uh, but it's about I, to get weird, Donald. It's about us. And uh, and Don. Dim, Don Don, Donald Don, Trump uh, is my let's, name. Let's jump into but another Dave category. Cheater, Are you going to yeah. prosecute Hillary Clinton? I love Hillary. She's wow. wonderful. She's Wait a, a tough woman. Wow. She's a tough woman. She's a good friend. She called to congratulate me. Uh, Bill called to congratulate me. Right. Essentially, anybody that I meet or talk to is okay. But everyone. What about Hulk Hogan, though? I love Hulk Hogan. I've met Hulk Hogan. Tremendous guy. I heard he gave you a call when you. He gave me a election. call. He gave me a call. He was very gracious. He said it was one of the most unbelievable runs he's ever seen. What? He said it may have even been better than his world championship run. Oh, wow. Of wow. 1983. Okay. <laughs> well, Donald, on. we want to thank you for coming by. Yeah, uh, this is a big show for us. Yeah. I'm, I'm very excited. It's important. This is going to be a, a new America. And I want to say, I'm very proud of you boys. Thank you. For, Thanks, Don. I don't think that you should have left Fox. Oh, wait, wait, that, no, no. But wait, I, do, hey. but I wow. do think that Megyn Kelly uh, is very unfair. But I love well, Megyn Kelly. Well, but she's been very unfair. And if you can get have her on the show here, I wouldn't. Oppose, but I will not come back if you have Megan. Kelly. Okay, well, okay, she's, well, not, said, she's not coming back. Okay, then. so no. then you guys go to Fox yeah. News. If you did the fighter, the kid, and the billionaire no. on Fox News, I like that. And yeah. then, and Maybe then, not, and, I like okay. where your head's at. Well, we how about that. the fighter and the kid and the president elect? Yes, that's a great idea. It's um, a great idea for yeah. a show. Well, thank you, Donald, so much. Okay, bye. bye, -bye. Voice, uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin was on the show yesterday, and he was oh, saying how awesome. he was asking about Snapchat. He was asking about yeah. Snapchat. He's like, should I should I get on Snapchat? Do yeah. I need Snapchat? I'm like, mm, they got all them fucking filters. You can make your face look like a little fucking girl <laughs> with the shiny fucking diamonds and shit. <laughs> Hell, you could even have a, a fucking clown face or a fucking dog with where, you, with where your tongue comes out. He's a If y'all want to see Stone Cold Steve Austin as a dog, a cute dog with his tongue flapping out, give me a hell yeah. What? A uh, hell yeah. Uh, Brian, don't do that while I'm doing an impersonation. Sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. Bad. I always wants to try he, out every impersonation. I, I'm just doing a little bit of a bit. Bucking we like to. Oh, fuck. Oh, not man. bad. Hey, that's what we Bit you know, killer. We've, yeah, bit killer. Hey, You've been, I'm, I'm, I'm Steve Cold. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Steve Colbert. Stone <laughs> Steve, Steve Colbert. Steve Cold is ice. I'm Steve Cold. Dude, that's not Cold bad. Stone. That's not bad. You that is some impersonations you, with your, me? Yeah, I do. Would you like to? Yes. Okay. Would you like to? Let's play a little game. Okay. Brendan, you give me an impersonation. Maybe something you've never heard me do before. Maybe yeah. maybe something that I can't do. And then I'll do it. And then you do the shitty yeah. version. And I'm, all of Tommy Blanchard. Well, I'm pretty good. But Man, no. that's tough. You know what? I mean, you've done it, but I'd like to compare the two. Okay. I like a, a just Trump. Let's start yeah. easy. Let's okay. start easy with Trump. You're already making yeah. the face because you don't know what you're doing. Yes. <laughs> like he's, don't, don't fucking. Like don't he's about judge, to drink. Don't judge my fucking. Well, that, okay. well that me, just so I'm not biased, me, Chin, and Agent A will vote. Super. Okay. I love it. Okay. Here's, here's a little bit. We're going to. Yeah. Uh, we're going to just do something. A little simple saying. Yeah. Okay. Let's uh, paint a scenario. Let's pretend we're in the Oval Office. Yeah. We're just having a little fun. Donald Trump. Um, um, let's say he's watching me 
and Kellyanne Conway. He would say, uh, yeah, bend her over and fuck her hard, Will. Now you say it. I'm not going to say something that Why not? misogynist. Okay. Because, and I really mean this, it's cheating. That's actually not bad. It's not and bad. it's mean. It's not bad. Yeah. That's actually pretty good. Yeah. I have nothing to do with Russia. 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 You got to put a little rasp in I have nothing to do with Russia. Russia. Say China. I have no... Whisper China. China. No, whisper it. China. China. But make China. it gravelly. China. 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 <laughs> China. China. That's pretty good. It's not bad. That's really good. I'm a brilliant mimic. Keep okay. going. What else? What else? Do you want another one? Um, Hi, I'm Ray Romano. Ah, that's Mark. I, oh, wow. I've never done. It's <clears throat> terrible, Brian. Hold on. We it's don't a, need to vote it's on that. It's a super that. relevant. Oh, yeah. It's a relevant oh, impersonation yeah. that kids need to hear. Oh, yeah. I'm Ray Romano. I'm Ray Romano. My, my brother's... Hi, I'm a honey. Well, we found Hi, Ryan's range. Yeah. <laughs> my brother's tall. My brother. My brother's tall. My wife tells me what to do, and my, pa- my parents are here. It's been a long time since I've ever... I've never tried this. That's terrible, No, B. it's not bad. It's so bad. Hold it's, on. It's, can you do Kermit the Frog? It's similar at the same yeah. range. Why hold, hold. are there so many there songs so about... Many. John Denver, yay! John. <clears throat> Brian. Say, John Denver, yay! John... John Denver, yay! And now, Linda Ronstadt, and now, yay! And now, Linda Ronstadt, yay! Oh, f- yay. oh fuck. Yeah, that's fuck. fucking sad. It's so sad for me to do... That's when you know you're I'm getting... I'm Kermit the Frog. I am Kermit the... Yeah, what I the am, fuck are... I am Kermit the Frog. I didn't grow up with these guys. <laughs> you didn't grow up? Why? Where well, were you? you, know, you Wait, are you making Ray. excuses right now? You study Ray. You well, know. let me give you this. Yeah. Clint Eastwood. Oh, <clears throat> real. let him go first. Well, I'm not doing no Clint Eastwood. You can. Hey, I, I think he. Yeah. Dying. Dying ain't much of a living boy. Yeah. Dying. Dying ain't much of a living. All right. This one's on your way. G- give me your best Russian. We'll end on this. Give me your best Russian. Rush. Russian? Russian. I would like to do uh, John Malkovich in Rounders. Oh, oh my God. One of my favorite all, movies. All day he chick, chick, chick. Pay him. Pay that man his money. <laughs> That's pretty <laughs> fucking good. I, I would like to do just Russian, but I have to think about what kind of Russian. Oh, very good. Give me a Siberian uh, KGB operative, uh, deep, just you, just in a snow cover in you Siberia. Are, you, are, you are here not for walrus, but because you are enemy of the state. <laughs> I sound like Dracula. <laughs> 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 in you are enemy state. Because I was pretending <laughs> to be Dracula, but in fact I'm from Russia. And you must die because Vladimir Putin has asked me to. It's pretty good. That's pretty good. Yeah, I'm yeah. very good. Yeah, impressions are stupid. Uh, <laughs> I like Dracula. I've always liked... I've always wanted to be... I've always wanted to say this, and I don't know how to do it, but when the wolves howl, we're yeah. going to howl, and I want you to say, ah, the children of the night, what sweet music they make. And I want you to do uh, it as, so as Dracula. As Dracula. And I'd like you to be involved in this, too. Uh, wait, I'm howling? Well, you'll howl, and if you want to do Dracula and try your hand at Dracula, you can Let as well. Let me hear it. So, <clears throat> um, oh! Beautiful. And then you say, <laughs> Ah, the sweet children of the night. What's the second part? What sweet music. What sweet music they play, right? They make. They make. Yeah, but do it with a little more relish. Ah, the sweet, ah, the sweet children of ah, the night. Ah, the children of the night. What sweet, what sweet music they make. Ah, the children. I'm, what do I sound like? All right, that? let me try. Ah, the children of the night. What sweet music they make. It's a little oh, it's a little Arnold though, huh? Yeah. Yeah, come yeah. on, do it. Come on, kid, get on Arnold here. as Dracula is very yeah. good. This is my biggest role to date. Arnold Schwarzenegger's Dracula. Well let's cut to a clip. Let's cut to a clip. Uh, oh yeah, you guys actually... have a clip of Arnold Schwarzenegger's Dracula. Yeah, this right? yeah, is yeah, awesome. Arnold oh wow. Uh, so, you gotta tell us about working with Arnold Schwarzenegger and Arnold Schwarzenegger's Dracula. <laughs> it was, must have been amazing, right? It was really you were amazing. the wolf, right? Yeah, I was the wolf. And, uh, and then you have that scene where you guys communicate and he and, says, and you know, I gotta say he did a great job he was he was yeah. scary and he's i believe that he drank blood believable he was believable. Believable. he's a very disciplined so why don't we cut to a clip let's cut to a clip here we are here's a clip of arnold schwarzenegger in arnold schwarzenegger's dracula uh, oh. yeah. uh the sweet the children of the night yeah what sweet music did they make yeah i'm dracula 
<laughs> and we're back. Wow. wow. That was really yeah, good. It's the it's the <laughs> it's so much range yeah. Arnold has. Yeah. This is his most like yeah. just yeah. out of the box. And dude, role. you're like you're amazing. like half wardrobe and half like was that like that Andy Circus CGI shit? Yes. And by the you way, you look amazing. How about this? We found a clip of Donald Trump back in 1987. What? When he wanted to be an actor. I don't know if you ever saw that where oh, he wow. played Dracula. That's right. He was in that, that yes. he was in Donald and, Trump's Dracula. And we have a clip where the guy says, um, would you like some wine? And and Donald has Dracula. Dracula said, "No, I never, I never drink wine, and oh. it's really oh, it, okay. It's, let's, yeah. let's have a look. At so that. why don't we cut to that clip? That's all he says, though. Yeah. Count, would you like some wine? No, I never drink wine. Oh. <laughs> and there, there wow. he was playing. Wow, Wolf. not I the best, though. No, not the best. Not the best. Not as scary as no, it's like not as scary as Arnold. I feel like Donald didn't commit to the role. Now, you, you know? guys also have a clip of, is this true? Hulk Hogan <laughs> was do. in the WWE. Yeah, it's like Expendables 9. Yeah. yeah. And yeah. Where he, he played, plays Dracula. He plays yes. Dracula. It was like right in between uh, No Holds Barred yeah. and Suburban and Commando. And this is him reacting to the wolves again. And uh, what, was the, have, what was the line that he... Well, it was, ah, uh, uh, the children of the night. Yeah. What sweet music they make. I can't wait to get my hands on them. Oh, okay. That's right. I yes. forgot that. Yeah. Okay. So uh, why don't we cut to the clip? Yeah. Let's see. Oh. Yeah, brother. Yeah, dude. It's a wolf, brother. Ah, oh, the children of the night, dude. What sweet music they make, brother. Yeah, dude. Yeah, brother. Would you like some what? wine, Count? No, dude. I never drink wine, brother. And milk is for babies, awful Alfred. You got to drink beer, dude. Or unless you're making a protein shake, brother. Crack a few eggs in there, awful Alfred. And then you could drink it back. We put a banana in there. We put this special green powder, dude. And then... Uh, Any blood? And then the blood. I want to drink your protein... Blood. All right, we're back. That wow. was amazing. God, oh, again, I never Hulk's saw that really, movie. Yeah, he's really reaching. Really good this. stuff. Man, Thanks, buddy. Amazing. Thanks. That was really amazing. Glad let's you had let's have a look at this clip. Oh, the children of the night. What oh, sweet music they make. I forgot about Ray Romano playing Dracula. This, my, my wolf brother was very tall. <laughs> and my wolf parents are here. And my wolf wife wants to go to the ballet, but I want to watch football. Really good. That's wow, man, so good. Ray Romano and Hulk Hogan yeah, playing they were all really good. relevant impersonations too. That all the youngsters, yeah, <laughs> Ray Romano. Oh and boy. so now she can't completely oh. close her eyelids. Oh, and she no. has to roll her eyes and look as far back as possible to sleep. Oh, well, but she got a refund hey, and hey, about take a look five at that, grand. Take a look at that yeah. picture, though, everybody. Ready? This is only for um, people who listen to the latter part of the 10-minute podcast yeah. with all the wrestling references. Ready? Here, check this out. You ready? This will be fun. Rest in peace. <laughs> right, Brian? Now, yeah. you know what that is, right? Uh, yeah. You know that that's the Undertaker when he rolls his yeah. eyes back in yeah, his yeah, head yeah, and yeah. says, rest in peace. Hey, Chin, could you bring up some YouTube footage <laughs> no, of The Undertaker rolling no. his eyes back? Now, hold on a second, Brian. <laughs> I've seen it. Now, hold on a second, Brian. This is the kind of fun stuff we'll be doing on our podcast okay. when we put that together. We'll get all some right. bread and some butter, and it'll all, all right. be real. All right. Wrestling's real to me. Well, all right. It's real, right? Okay, I got you. I mean, it's something that I I yeah, believe is a, let's see the a worthy art form. <clears throat> Just, uh, uh, you will rest in peace right there. No, no, no. Up a bit. That's the one. <laughs> you will rest in peace. Okay, so she's that's her, and she does a very good <laughs> undertaking. Rest, rest in peace. Well, I, I'm sure that's not helpful for her, but all right. All right, that's really funny. Now I'm going to put that on the internet. <laughs> okay. She had, she had botched eye surgery. Yeah, <laughs> botched eye surgery. Rest in peace. Because the Undertaker, right, Brian? You know the Undertaker, right? It's wrestling. You like wrestling? No, nope, I was a wrestler. Yeah, it's wrestling. I like real wrestling, you know. Yep, real wrestling. That's not with real. the Undertaker. It's not real wrestling, though. And and that, and, that, and, 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 and and that's the effects of aluminum that is in all of our medications. I don't think and, so. And, Alex. And, 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 and and George uh, and Sundar Pichai, yeah, you, who's you allowing these it. communists uh, in the China, China yeah. to censor. Yeah. And, 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 and edit 
<laughs> okay, so that was more Alex on on uh, aluminum. Jim, so he really stop goes crazy. Playing the Alex Jones. <laughs> yeah, stop, Sorry. Jim. Just stop. We're just trying Alex. to do the. We have an Alex Jones hunt. button. Oh, you have like so a Chin, sound. Yeah, and so Chin, soundboard. Chin gets kind of crazy. Oh, we should play with um, the Alex Jones soundboard. That's right. That's yeah. right. Make now, the frogs gay. Ah, uh, shit. Make the frogs take gay. That, take that. Stop. Okay. <laughs> Make the frogs gay. Right. Damn it. It's not working. And they're making the frogs gay. Ah, fuck. Can you, what's How going many on of those there? do you oh, need? You yeah. don't need two different buttons. Well, he the... likes to he likes to punctuate that after right. we, you know, sometimes Yeah, but they're all different. Talk. There he all, is. All they are is different versions of making the there frogs is. gay. He's having a tough time right now, Alex. Yeah. He's sweating. This is what a real human looks like. I, I like to eat. I like to have babies. You hear that? I like to fight. Yeah. Chin. Yes. It's okay. one nutritious thing. Okay. Here comes a nutritious thought. Candy mouth. Here comes a nutritious thought. Go ahead, Candy. <laughs> you want me to say, you want me to? Yeah. Me to I'm tired of get candy. Get into a deep, a deep. I'm t- I can't live on hard candy. Yeah. All I the have is hard candy. The only reason I'm not running. <laughs> oh, fuck. Is because. Oh, shit. If I join the Greenies, uh-huh. that'll take votes away from the Democrats. All right. Well, but maybe I could run with a Democrat. Well, what does that mean, Jesse? But, that, but they would never do that. But Governor, what, what are you saying? Well, I'm just saying perhaps I could run with someone who's already in the Democratic field. That's how you take out Trump, and he's a friend of mine. He's a friend of yours? I'm quite fond of Donald. I, do. I don't share some of his uh, policies. Right. You know that. Yeah. I live in the Baja six months out of the year. Well, I like that you would run against him because you're taller, you're bigger and stronger. I'm taller, I'm bigger. He couldn't bigger. bully you. I, as you know, I have a thousand gallons of potable water I, and a silo full of tortillas. I didn't know that. Down in the Baja. I didn't know that. I now own over 300 dogs. What? Most of them are little dogs, terriers. Why do you own dogs? Because I surround myself with dogs and corn and okay. guns. Okay, why? And that's my platform. That will be one of my policies. Which is what? Seven years of corn, two guns, and three small dogs. For everyone? For everyone. Seven years of corn? Seven ears, not years. Sorry, dude. You know how much seven years of corn would have cost? That would bankrupt uh, the country uh, faster than uh, than right. the, the you know the, the 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 Green New Deal. But I feel like seven years of corn, or uh, or, or or the the national debt. Well, how much? How many? How much corn in an ear? Uh, 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 each ear is of corn is an ear of corn. Right. So that would be. That would be. A, See, you don't understand your corn. You oh. probably never served in the military. I, I did. You've never had to shuck corn in the mess hall. I have. That's the difference between you and I. Okay, but what is a you? E- you you call yourself an American? I was a Navy SEAL. How long can you hold your breath underwater? Me? I can hold. No, the the the, the okay. The, I don't know the I, idiotic steampunk grandfather clock behind you. I, Fucking. Uh, I, I can hold my breath for probably the, two minutes. I can hold my breath for 17 minutes. That seems like a world record. I don't know if that's true. Well, why, why you, are you calling me a liar? I'm not calling you a liar. You I, probably think that Tower 7 uh, fell because it was compromised during uh, the uh, 9-11 terror attacks. I, I don't want to get into that. It fell on its own. Okay. Minutes well, later. Yeah, I know that. Would I'm you a... like to run for president with me? <laughs> me? I don't know anybody who could get me started. I just keep asking people to rally around me. I, yeah. I don't know the first thing about running for president. Well, you ran for governor. You were governor. Yeah, I kind of forgot most of that. CTE. Well, oh, and, shit. And, and et cetera. Yeah. yeah. Too many chair shots to yeah, the head. Yeah, you're a big fella. So, so what do you say? Ventura Cal in 2020? I don't think so. I don't have the time. Why not? I, I'm just not interested in being. Oh, what are you doing? What are you, busy? I don't think we could win, Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> Why, why, can, why wouldn't we win? I, I, because I'm a comedian and I've got skeletons in my closet and then they, they, would, <laughs> they, would, they, would, they would find out what a piece of shit I am. Yeah, but you'd only be the vice president. I know, but. Yeah, I, just be like Pence. I just, Never go out for dinner with a woman. Okay. I, That's all you have to do as the vice president. Right. Stand there. You know, we'll put you in some uh, some shoes with lifts in them. Yeah. So you get close to me. I'm six foot four. Uh, uh, mm, uh-huh. And yeah. then we'll run against the Donald. He's a friend of mine. Okay. He'll tell us how to beat him. All right. Have, has, have, do we have that tape on on Donald Trump? The piss tape, Brian? <laughs> yeah, well, he... Doesn't exist yet. Oh, okay. All right. I just thought what we tape? had it. I just thought we had tape on Donald Trump talking about <laughs> thanking you for his vote. I don't know. 
Oh, yeah. Wait, you mean this Donald Trump? <laughs> Hi, I'm Donald Trump. <laughs> that's a I got terrible. my dick sucked in the that's Oval a, Office. That's a fucking, that's Bill Clinton saying he's Donald Trump. I'm Donald Trump. I'm my wife, Michelle. Yeah, they're pretty good, right? <laughs> that, that, I can do any president, everybody. Go ahead. Uh, fuck, man. Oh, Barack Obama. No, 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 no. I already did that. Go like old, uh, though. Uh, old. Uh, Real uh, old. George Washington? I'm George Washington. I will not tell a lie. And that's exactly what he sounds like. No, you can listen Abe to Abe Lincoln said yep, that. Didn't you he? could listen to Andrew Jackson's podcast. He had uh, he had uh, George Washington on. I'm on a stabe. Pretty good, Keep right? Plugging at it because they're trying to bury us. And thank God for President Trump, who's no, going to take on all this I don't media malfeasance give, and lying CNN. I don't think you can get and Trump Jim credit. Acosta, who's out there at a, a wall saying, "Well, there it seems to be peaceful by the wall." You're standing by a wall. Yeah. Wall. All right. Chin. I'm oh, sorry. Chin. Yeah, he went crazy on the wall thing. So oh, yeah. I yeah. just wanted to play that. Um, well, that's, and my, just, my question is, did you get, ask Kellyanne Conway? Did you get like any? Hey, those bags aren't under her eyes because she's getting a lot of sleep. <laughs> all right. Well, well, keeping her up all that, that, night. Oh, 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 she was up. Oh, that's right. Hey, um, a little Andrew <laughs> Dice Clay for the polar bears. Oh, yeah. That's, oh yeah, that's, I saw this fucking, I saw this beluga whale, and I says to her, "Oh, do you want to eat the school of fish?" And then I fucked her. Oh. So I saw this, uh, this narwhal with the huge uh, unicorn. Then I said, "Man, they put it up my ass and massage my prostate." Oh, that's a really good. Answer. That's, that's, that's what I did with job. the polar bears. No, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. that's really good, dude. Wow, Listen, man, this has become a very strange story. Thank you for sharing it, though, and we really appreciate it. Oh. It's positive that the Callan bloodline runs cold. And it's it, it, these are cold blooded aliens. Wait a minute. And I've seen it. And you, you voted for Hillary. I and didn't your vote father for Hillary. Voted for Hillary. No, that's and not, she's evil. No. And 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 your friend Joe Rogan. Yeah. Who and I love Joe. Okay. And we go back a long time. That's right. Uh, would not have me back on the show. And and and, and well, you and, were a little and, crazy and, on the show. And 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 Mike Mike and 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 he wants to be on your program, yeah. and you say you're going to reboot the Brian Cab, the 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 the, 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 the. All right. chin chin. Sorry. Don't play Alex. Well, I was Jones just on one of your cohorts. He's over here, right? Theo Vaughn. <laughs> yep. Where is he next door? Yeah, but don't don't knock on the. Just keep talking. <laughs> well, he's banging on the fucking shit when he's. I know, but. All right. Anyway, just stick to. All right. What so, you're saying, dude. So the and he was like. Oh, well, you know, why don't you try, try uh, stand up, bro? You could be like, you could be out there with a bag of potatoes, just being gang gang. And um, that's, that's good, my theory. I'm that's working a really on really good theory. Yeah, <laughs> you'd be out there with a bag of potatoes and a and a can of can of Cool Whip. Yeah, that's good. So you um, got to do it. Well, Alex, just, you can't do stand up comedy. I want to do stand up comedy. Well, what would you Your say? Your friend Joe Rogan said that I could come out to his concentration camp he didn't say in that. Valencia and do stand-up for all the people out there, and he's harvesting no. their organs. No, he doesn't. And Google is evil. No, that's not true. <laughs> and they, yep, and Sundar Pichai is... Is 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 is, is, is oh. chipped in behind our ear. They don't have a chip and, in Yeah, and your friend Joe Rogan is implanting chips. No, he's not. Yes, he is. And I can tell you he's not. He's he harvesting doesn't... organs. He doesn't have and a he's got people organ harvesting in Valencia, and he's got a bunch of black market doctors harvesting no, he organs. They, they, you know, and he's got them to... doing Falun Gong and Falun Dafa meditation. No, he doesn't. And it's keeping their spirit clear. And then he's harvesting their organs I don't... and selling it to George Soros, who's <laughs> Buying spreading this around. What's he doing with the organs? He's and those are being used for rich oil magnates. Oh, in their eat, cauldrons? Yes, in their cauldrons, and they're eating too much fatty foods and pork, and they're and 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 then they have these health problems, and they're getting a brand new set of kidneys from your friend Joe Rogan, and I love Joe, and he's a great guy, and he's smarter than me. But you're saying he's just he knows just as much as I do. No. And he's yeah, implanting chips. So until Chin, <laughs> sorry, I mean, it, there's only a few minutes.